All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, let's go. Day four, AMD software, OGA, Dota Pit, China. I am General Jivikis, Royal Never Give versus E Home. Best of three, game one. IO is banned. Goodbye, Viper. Goodbye, Phoenix. Chiefs uh, just to a, make the call. I don't know. Moron. We're making the call. Yeah, this is my time to pick, now. It, pick it good. Come on, radiant team. You pick. Okay. We get into the Mars. We pick up the Rubik. Undying still a thing. Lena still a thing. Dan still a thing. Totally disagree. Jeeves have been wrong most of the time nowadays. I got five out of no. Oh, I want to say I got six out of seven right yesterday. You, you, you really got to pick a hero. You got ten seconds left. Oh, look, it's the uh, chance. You, you, you just, just like I said. Seconds. Um, hopefully, I'm dying here. It seems a little bit passive. Maybe us. Oh, you want something with a bit of wave clear, right? Wave clear and a save? That's a big ask. Commander, man. Oh, you could go for, like, uh, Enchantress. XJ Proudly, thank you for the follow. Speak friend and enter. Keep it clean, keep it PMA. Blood Seeker. Nah, all I did was stop making bets because I'm over 3 million now. No one's catching up. Oh, Luba. You must be desperate indeed to come here for entertainment, my friend. So someone who doesn't want to move, you know, who's all about standing still and doing damage. I mean, anyone with a root, really. Sven! Sven wants to move. I mean, Sven Chen's pretty classic. I didn't expect the Sven to come out this early, though. That's caught me off guard just a little smidgen. Is e home time to respond? Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Um, you you, you better pick your hero. Five seconds. Woo, radiant team bands. <sighs> Disco Stew, Mark News removed. Hmm. I mean, oh, Disco Stew is real good with Sven, right? It's a it's a pressure maker, space creator. The Magnus ban, though, because they expect to see, like, the PA-style counter from E-Home. But S-Triple-C, he doesn't mind the old Terror Blade, so... I imagine they ban it. Day 3 UFC fights were cancelled. Indeed, I needed to cast Dota 2 so I could fight today. All right, get rid of the Undying, get rid of the Beastmaster. I've seen this before, the Chen plus Beastmaster, it's overwhelming. You, you really gotta pick a hero, you got 10 seconds left. I, even with decent I wave clear, you have problems. Then we'd have been banned, yeah, most likely, most likely. The Earth Spirit. So maybe we look back towards the Dry Ranger slash Morphling pickup for E Home here. Alice is an E Home, yes. You, you, you really got to pick a hero. You got 10 seconds left. Um, you, you, you better pick your hero. Five seconds. Come on, Radiant 
Baseless Void. Get yeah, the Lena. Undying Tombstone's gone. I mean, it's just a flexible hero versus Terror Blade, right? Laguna Blade versus Terror Blade, very strong. Hmm. It's pretty good versus the Morphling as well. So does this force them into the Dry Ranger pick? Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. S Triple C is E Home. Clanks, that's another good hero actually for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Clinks are terribly, that's it. In fact, you can go for both. Both is a bit excessive, especially. Is Lena gonna be four or mid? Oh, that's a nice big can opener. Slardar, not picked or banned, by the way. They go for the task for a little bit of save. Plus the hand of God. That's a lot of save. That is a lot of save. I like the Elder Titan pickup, though. It, it means they haven't invested in their cores yet, right? The only problem is task kind of wrecks. Morphling, Terror Blades. I guess Dry Ranger as well, but not Clinks. Gonna go the troll. Clink's build's like the medallion, right? The solar crest build up. Troll Warlord. Now, Troll Warlord does deal with Sven not too badly. They take out the OD. Uh, they have a pretty dumb team, this is true. Take out Puck. Goodbye, Batrider. I feel like Batrider's are pretty fine. You, you, you really gotta pick a hero. You got ten seconds left. Disabled my flamage guy. Yeah, Batman. Five seconds left. Um, hmm, final ban here. I mean, just any mid hero. I think to go Death Prophet on Royal Never Give Up. Yay. Okay. I mean, they can still go Shadow Fiend if they want the early Rose potential, but the Void Spirit feels way better. I like that a lot. This storm spirit looking at least okay, right? Now well, they have some silences. The pack was already banned by them. Are you going in Joker? Yo, Shadow One, what is up? In the mid. Yeah, it is an eye for sure with the Tusk Champ pickup. Oh, yeah, it could be off lane Tusk. It could be off lane Tusk. I feel like that's actually going to be low key good versus the troll, right? Darks. Choose your hero. Darks. Uh, it's looking like E-Home to me, but let's see how it rolls down the hill, boys. For the AMD Sapphire OGA Dota Pit China, Game 1, Day 4. For E-Home, XM Void Spirit, S Triple C Troll Warlord, X Nova Elder Titan Chalice, and the Bloodseeker Fade Rubik. For Royal Never Give Up, Super Chen, J, Mr. J on the Sven, Setsu Lina, Felix Chalba on the Tusk, and Surf on the Darkseer. I am General G because let's get our Dota 2 on.
Now let's go in with a bare chest there. Arcs here, I think it's straight up the counter, huh? I like this draft. Will not beat the shit out of Darks here. Does Elder Titan not counter Sven and Dan? Does Charles not shut down Darks here when Felix Chalbaz not there? What does the robot say? The robot says 14 points draft advantage RNG. Okay, okay, the Dark Seer. The Dark Seer. No mangoes? A single mango. Frog will be lamenting. Oh boy. Didn't see that coming, did you? I sense distortions. No, no new PC yet. I got most of the parts sitting behind me in a pile. It's amazing. But no case till Monday and no um, RAM till Monday. Oh my god, the battle's about to start. Relax, Morty. Relax. Come here. Come here, buddy. Come here. I was hoping the case would come yesterday and I could at least put the machine together and just wait for the RAM. But hey ho. But we maybe get calm stream on Wednesday, guys. Calm stream on Wednesday. Who's that blowing the horn? Like probably take me like a day to get it set up. Um, get all the drivers and all that shit done. Then I need to transfer all of the files for streaming and install Dota 2. So. What's the biggest draft advantage I've ever seen? 100%. 100% draft advantage. I think the robot was broken those days, though. I'm um, 99% sure it was. But I think 80... So, 160-point draft advantage is the most I've ever seen. I'm pretty sure the team with the really bad draft advantage won as well. I ordered all the stuff on the same day for next day delivery, Thunderbird Delilah, but it came between, um, I want to say, three and ten days, each one. Will you make an unboxing and building video? Nah. Nah, that doesn't sound like a fun time. I could make a video, actually. I'm not going to stream it, though. I could make a video. Most people are saying to assemble the CPU when the thing is not in the case. So, I might do that. Bet against Sven, RNG. The bet E-Home? Oh, I, should, I close the bets, huh? Didn't see that coming, did you? Wow, everyone on E-Home, huh? RNG from form alone look like they should win this game. Like, they have been playing very well indeed. I mean, the bounties pick up. It's gone 50-50 as a result. 50-50 on the bounties, yep. Oh, are they supposed to pressure early? Now shall the battle 
Did I catch a nice deal on Black Friday? No, Thunderbird Delilah. Trying to order PC parts at the moment. I actually paid more for the parts, and it's all second gen. Last generation, it's a uh, Ryzen 3900X. It's um, a 5700XT DDR6 at 1900 megahertz. Uh, it's 32 gigabytes of DDR4 3600 megahertz RAM. Uh, a couple of NVMEs. Um, yeah, it's all last gen. No, there was nothing, Sean. There was literally nothing. Like, I only got that graphics card because it was literally the best thing I could get. It was actually in stock. And even then, the stuff that was supposedly in stock, like I say, they didn't even ship my case until, like, Thursday. When I made the order last Friday. If they shipped it on Friday, it would have been here on Monday, Tuesday, last week. The RAM is coming from America, so I'm a little bit sus that that's going to get here at all. Last time I checked, it was still at Tamworth. All right, we're back in the game. Let's go, Charlie. He's building Wraith Band. He's building Power Treads. He's building Stick. Wonder if he'll go Atos, most likely. Dude, that was a lot of damage on his fan. He's looking at 680 HP. His first Bracer not on hand yet. Look how damaged the enemy team are. He really wants to be level 2. Look at this. Look at this. Chalice gets level 2. He instantly gets like 500 movement speed. What a time to play around that as well. What a time to play around that. You're like, okay, he's level 1. Not going to be sped up. I mean, if he had taken the passive, I know he would never take the passive. But if he'd taken the passive, I think he can dominate this lane super early and stop Sven from ever getting that level 2. I don't know, I don't know. Pops off the salve, gets himself back to fighting condition up top. S triple C. Throwing out those axes. Throwing out those axes. X Nova's in here with a stapler. No extra damage. Feels rather puny without it, I have to say. Stomp though. Felix Child Bar, you're gonna be first blood, sir. He's gonna try for it. Here we go into the trees. X Nova gonna be the one to chase him. S triple C. I mean, you could focus on CS right now. You don't need to chase this kill. Wait till it's closer to happening. And all the way out on the outside, which means someone's gonna kill, die somewhere else. Oh, look at these. Troll have continued to chase. Maybe got the root down. Nah, I think you're missing way too much CS if you do that. Oh, this is great for e for X Nova though. Yeah, pull up here, try and get more of this damage. Very nice. That's gonna be a good 52 or so. Dude, even run them through the creep. Got plus 50 damage. You can give them the old chomp. Dude, just right click them. Okay, well I mean this this is super good. I just I mean he had so much damage there. I don't know, I don't know. Maybe he should have, uh, maybe he should have got a little bit aggressive with it. Just pa well, I don't know, he tried to set up for some sort of double kill, right? But without the extra beat down that he was going to put down anyway in the first place, it wasn't going to happen either way, so... Like, the, the same result happens either way. He either harasses both of them a good deal, or and they run away, or he harasses them both a good deal, and they run away. Could pull through here though. Plenty of ghosty damage. Nice shards. Well, not actually nice. It's good for uh, Elder Titan, but that's about it. And Surf, 295 movement speed. Of course, he has the uh, the surge to get away if he feels like he's really in trouble. Good play by X Nova. Pulls the aggro off on the creeps. You know, stops himself from going in under the tower. Alice is getting hammered here by this fan just a little bit on the old CS. <sighs> oh, this is pretty good though. Well, I mean, he stops the fight into that. It's, uh, it's a little bit questionable. Let's have the tango running though. Here comes Super with a penance. Chalice, he's here by himself. Rubik, of course, was helping get that four minute bounty rune into XM. It's a haste rune. Whether or not he puts this to use fairly soon. Are they fighting up top? No. Five minute bounties. Next big objective. 
dead, except from Chen. Chen's fine, don't worry about it. Charles getting a little bit low. Points in the passive now. So nerfed this hero. Buy one, get one free pizza everywhere. Sounds awesome to me. You buy one and send me the other one, Sean. That's the play. I'm the Jaggernaut. Bitch. Yo, Jaggernaut, how are you doing? I did say hello to Shadow One, right? I'm pretty sure I said hello to Shadow One. Hope everything's groovy. Everyone's in a good condition, physically, mentally. Spiritually? I guess. Felix Chalba, he goes down. First blood, we saw it boys, 100% of bloods, 100% of the time. I knew that hay stream would come in handy at some point. Yo guys, I dead ass got an email, a business email. Uh, and at the bottom of the business email, right at the very bottom, it said, uh, Jesus Christ, our Lord, our Lord Jesus Christ, exclamation mark. And I was like, what the fuck is this? That's still a thing that people put on their, their cards? I don't know. I don't know. Bloodseeker's dead, Chiefs. Bloodseeker is dead. Let's check that out. I felt like he just died too quick. Oh, okay. So he tries this little one trick again. The Stormhammer lands Chalice. He gets rectified. Felix with his shards, the punch. It's tag team, but it's, it's all good if you're Sven in the lane. Nope, Sean, unfortunately, you have to wear your badge of shame, but, I mean, if you spam the chat afterwards, no one's gonna know, right? Maybe if you whisper the bot, try whispering the bot, your commands. Maybe if you whisper the bot, Sean. Whisper swag to the bot, it might, um, it might tell you. Wow, by the way, by the way, Sven has Mask of Madness finished. Ow. People don't build Ags on Sven. I mean, not, it depends on the, who you're versus, right? So Morphling win a game today. Wow. It happens. It happens, especially in China. Oh jeez, Radiant's courier just got killed. Which draft is better? Um I mean we thought the E home draft, right? But RNG seem to be the ones who are uh Nah, it's E home. E home. But RNG are on like, uh, they're on the app and E-Home have been losing a lot recently, so. Feels bad, man. Let's have a look at net worth, maybe it gives a better picture. Yeah, RNG definitely performing way better here. Like overall. Way better, it's like 150 gold. Ooh, double damage for Setsu, that's gotta be relevant, right? Where is she? Where is she? Wait. Okay. He's 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 throwing he's he's throwing fists all right. Jesus. You know, going harm bones. Sven now with a mask of madness procked in the mid lane, pushing waves, then back off the creep camps. Nine minutes into the game. And it's Troll who's top of the bus for farm, by the way, because he take that tower bomb. It's building Battle Fury. I mean, I think Battle Fury's the way to go, right, with the wall? Yeah. 
get to Mr. Flaming Hearts. He's got a couple of null tallies, bottle brown boots, Chen with the medallion of courage. So they can go for a super early Roche. They have the lifesteal as well in the Sven, so. Ex Nova scouting with a ghosty. Felix Child Bar gonna be scouted. Oh, Sven is here. Oh, XM gets the silence on him. The silence comes through from Bloodseeker as well. I mean, that Sven is dead. The rupture to make sure he can't run anywhere. Job done. Uh oh, Chalice positioning's a little bit sticky here. Caught on the wrong side of the river. Well, in the river. Roll though, S Triple C. He's got Perseverance finished up now. He's just rolling. Talking about rolling. Here comes Tusk with a snowball play, maybe. Oh, but wait, XM is here. It's a little bit of a sticky trap. Chen, Chen coming in with a creep army. Got vision of this. Look, they get perfect vision. They know exactly what's happening. XM using the trees. Gonna try and debate here a little bit. Troll, are you coming over? Elder Titan is. Elder Titan happy to be part of this party. Be down the ghosty. Oh, I, I mean, everyone's aware of what's gonna happen here. So playing safe, playing it cautious for now. Aid up top, Surf is coming in. He's level 8, he's going for Guardian Greaves, pretty standard stuff. Arcane booties already done, as well as a bottle. Charles looking for an Atos, we kind of expected that. Ex Nova. Oh, his Triangle Boots online though. A little bit of speed. And Surf has his God Strength on. Oh, I guess he did Ancients, right? Yeah, probably did some Ancients. He's still behind on the old net worth of a troll. Still ahead. Still ahead. 11 minutes, almost Battle Fury done. He's got Power Tress as well, right? Two Wraith Bands. Oh, Phase Boots as well. Two Wraith Bands. Dude, that is... That's considerable farm. Give him this whole wave? Hell yeah. So both teams are just chilling farming right now. Super is building a creep army in the jungle. XM. Yeah, I mean, you could get something out of this. A little bit of gold profusion. And uh, Mr. J farming up nicely. He's got the Echo Saber almost done. Setting up the Ancients on the uh, minute mark. SCCC doing the same. Battle Fuse done, right? After these ancients. Oh no, it's a claymore it's left. A little bit more expensive. Okay, Chalice opens with the ATOS. Neither Rapture. They can't really get on top of him. Surf does have surge, but he doesn't want to surge that Sven, that's for sure. Rapture. It's got a second left on it. The wall on the backside. No X Nova. He's here now as well with the stomp down. XM in a lot of trouble. Got a zip away. He's in on top of Felix Child Bar though. Not the best place to land. Double kill for RNG. Yo, Chen is dead. This is true. Silence for a task. Noble Setsu racing forward here. He's a speedy Gonzalez. Fade. Oh, oh. Here comes the Dragon Slave. Sven going to get surged up. Comes in here with the Iron Shell. Life Strike Rate into Laguna. Oh, Battle Fury's done. 400 gold on top of that. All right, there we go. In hand. Ben is invulnerable while flying. I mean, they have been constantly farming, both teams, but, like, it's 14 minutes into the game, and Troll has 7.5k net worth. He is going to be fighting soon. Alright, 
right, here we go, the big fight starting off. Surf goes in pretty deep. Snowball from Felix Chalba, but XM still running free here. I mean, Surf, he's just dead. He does absolutely nothing. Pretty good split earth though, connecting on three. Well, Felix Chalba just on the edge of it, apparently. No real follow up though. Fighting a little bit. XM with the gaze pulls Felix Chow back in. Killing off Chen's creeps. Siege, it continues. Now it's five versus four. Another ATOS play, this time for Lena. She's the one to end up silenced. The fortification going to be used right now. Bounty runes are spawning, so Ken taking advantage of going top for those ones just now. Oh, he's trying to come around the outside with a net and de ward you. Alright, so um, you can rupture Svenly's flying, but you won't take any damage. Wait, they killed XM. That was pretty big. Hi, you know Blade him? Not pretty much. Dog teams, you know, dead. Oh, they're fighting mid, pushing it in. By the way, Rubik is dead. Jeeves, nice, nice. Because Radiant just fortified their structures. Tires of middle towers under attack. Six to four. It's fan with the Echo Saber, Mr. J. Echo Saber, Mask of Madness. XM is here. He wants to play. Ag Scepter on the way. Oh. Oh, look at this, the blink from Felix Child by goes for the dissimulate, pulls himself out of the danger zone. You're gonna go Roche? No, Sven's gonna go farm top. J TPing for farm. Oh, it does leave the rest of the squad a little bit vulnerable. A little bit vulnerable for the next 60 seconds or so. BKB coming on Troll Warlord. Wait, what's the AG stats on Lena? He's going BKB first, so a little while for the AGs on her. Surging Sven. See, he doesn't need Ags with this build. It's like with the Io, right? He's got this actual mobility. That's Triple C. PKB almost done. And I imagine that's when we start to see him fighting. I'm surprised no one's really looked towards the Roche bit. They do have pretty consistent eyes on the prize. A little scout, a little hill forest tree scout boy. Gonna block the camp. He doesn't block any of the camps, feels bad man. I wanted to steal a creep anyway, I guess so. Imp Claw. Oh, that's a great pickup for RNG. That is going to boost Sven's farm considerably. Like, you can literally just one hit creep comes. You know when it's going to proc crit, right? And you always have your. Scoot on troll as well, actually. Got Van Brace for now though, stats for the win. Okay, Felix Chalba snowballing up here. Links away, decent, decent. They've got a surge. No, they used to the surge on the dark seer. All right, smoke, now looking for a counter play. Over here, it's super, it's Felix Chalba, it's surf, it's five of them, I'm not sure about this. I'm not sure about this one. They go for the Chen, try to hold him in place, disable him at the start of the fight. Okay, job done. Now, though, the BKB comes out for Troll. XM's coming in on top of Surf. Surf's been dealt with. The wall with the split earth as well. Sven, he's kind of melting. He's inside that snowball. He's still alive for now. No, he's, he's dead. It's a triple kill. 
for S triple C. Very, very well executed by Dyer there. Alright, they got the Aegis. It's on the troll. First Roshan secured. Bounty runes as well, 20 minutes. Very nice timing for this. Elder Titan, he's making the TP play for the one's bottom. Ooh. Lena going to be denied here. Does she cut across for the one up top? No. No, no, no. It's a professional player, not an idiot, Jeeves. So S Triple C, he's playing kind of brave right now. He's got the Aegis, you know. RNG were thinking about that. They were like, nah, he's got an Aegis. They back off. Bloodseeker, an easier target here. He's kind of hovering with Sven getting some action top. Just setting up the old creep base. He's 4k behind S Triple C right now. Oh, I love this tower play. Alright, they're smoked up though, they're looking for S Triple C. The initiation vector's not that great. X Nova now ready with the ghosties. And from the other side though, that's not too bad. S Triple C throws some axes, Felix Shafal, the blink forward, goes for the stun. Sven's there now as well. They rectify poor old Elder Titan in the back line. XM trying to draw them the other way. S Triple C now coming forward. Felix Shafal waiting to ambush Fade. Out he comes. Little stun for S Triple C by the way. Sven now ruptured up. The wall goes down. Sven looking for the TP. Will be successful. Gets his ass out of there. Super nice penance. Holds Chalice back. Chalice was slow. The creep army is here. The ice shards from downtown. Felix Chow Ba blocks them off on the chase. Probably gonna pay with his life. Negatory. He dodges the other way. Oh no, they found him this time round. Trying to take the tower through backdoor protection. Double damage. Lena's up and ready to fight. The stomp goes out. Does not connect on anything. Stormhammer on Rubik. I mean, it's only still 4k. Sven has been farming despite the uh, the interactions between the two teams. Chalice is having a little hunt here. Fade, he gets gets rooted by the net. Ready to push this tower. Chow back, close by. Come the creep. While Sven pushing here to top. There, but I don't think he can do anything about it. The fortification ready, but they don't use it. Top tower is under yeah, they, do they go back and try and fight right now? Oh my god, they're all there. Oh, the stolen storm hammer. <laughs> the stolen storm hammer. And I mean, Sven, you're like, go ahead, bro. If you want it, take that tower. I'm taking your tier three. I'm going to take your rats as well. Ding, ding, ding. I mean, how can they do anything about like this? They can't, right? Gonna go for the old two shot at the same time. They're all up. I mean, literally nothing they can do or what here. S triple C's digging into the tower. Lena's up. Sven is up. They've got a BKB and an Aegis to play with here. Carlos zone them with the silence. That's it. That's enough for E home. The styling is over. 
That was the war dance, man. That was a war dance. I mean, everyone's up. They're both up on both sides. They're like, come on, come on. You come on. No, you come on. And e home. Back off. Oh, if they can get a cheeky pick here as they try and come out and get some farm. Oh, they're smoked. They're going to get super. Oh, that's an easy pick up on the chain. Yep. Fade with a little green assassin bolt. Takes them out of there. There's more to be had here, though. Up, but the BKB comes out instantly from S Triple C. The Aegis is gone, by the way, so this is not as free of a situation as it would be otherwise. Gets a basher delivered, nice. Oh, Sven comes in, starts to deal with Charles on the backside. Said Sue, that's XM. He's in there amongst all three of them. The rupture's out, but watch out for White Striker A, the Laguna Blade as well. XM juking away. He's still alive. Ben is chasing though. Oh the BKB, the gaze that holds him back, the lift's there now as well, Sven, he's controlled for now, SCCC comes in with the axis, a whirling, and he's, uh, he's murdered Sven there, that was a great back, but nowhere near the wall right there, surface location just a little bit off, running, he's running, running, yeah, jeez, alright, what about Lena, uh, GG, the big GG, Yeah, I mean, that troll was just out of hand, man. As you see, he got farmed. And uh, E-Home, like I say, the draft just has answers to everything that RNG want to swing. Um, MVP for me. Ah, cool, it's 5-0-4, fade. Nah, it's got to be um, Bloodseek, right? Bloodseek? Yeah. Sam made some pretty good plays. I give it to Troll, actually. He just handed everyone their ass. Very good draft. Ricardo flickering. Look at it go.
nothing left now. Oh, dire team ban! Woo, radiant team ban! Dire team ban! All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome back to the MD Software OGA Dota Pit China. It's E Home versus Royal Never Give Up. I am General Jivikis, and oh boy, oh boy, E Home showing them what was what in game one. So much so the Bloodseeker gets banned out first phase. Goodbye, Undying. Goodbye, Phoenix. Goodbye, Io. Exert was the guy who was here for two hours and donated like five hundred dollars, five hundred pounds, thousand dollars for Comstrip. Mars. You, you, you really got to pick a hero. You got ten seconds left. Um, you you, you better pick your hero. Oh, five dire seconds. Team. Pick him up. Pick him. Team ban. Oh, those were some fast ass picks. Alina, Lifestealer, Rubik. Lifestealer. Super ban. early Lifestealer for Astro. Oh, Dire Team Ban. Ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Yeah, five seconds left now. All right, do 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 do. Slar Dar gone. Disco Stu gone. Morphling gone. Faceless Void gone. Alright, no Beastmaster. Terrorblade. Okay. Is Terrorblade the pick for dealing with Lifestealer anyway?
Go PA, right? But then he's going to get Monkey King Bar. It's not going to be trouble for him to pick that item up. Um, you, you, you better pick your hero. Five seconds. Dire team pick. Earth spirit, so no dry ranger for you, sir. Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Yeah, th 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 five seconds left now. Nah, not really, Jaggernaut. I'm just delayed a little bit. Radiant team pick. Like a minute delay, so. Omni Knight! Omni Knight plus uh, Sven. Hero, they can't pick uh, it now. They can't block it. That's what's happening. Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. I've not seen Ursa played properly for a while. Yeah, I think I might try with uh, doing the de the delay in game itself. Just waiting for a minute at the start. Cause the interaction's not as I thought a minute wouldn't be too bad. I was like, I'm pretty slow anyway. It reads. Come on, dire team, pick it, pick it good. Night stalker. Night stalker. So this is the early pressure, right? The Night Stalker plus the Earth Spirit are there to deal with whatever's coming from the back lines, but I think it's Sven. Oh man, Rick, there's only 10 seconds left to pick a hero. Um, you, you, you better pick your hero, five seconds. I mean, Ursa does give them super early Roche potential. And then what, a TA for mid? Dire team ban. Phantom Assassin. Oh, the PA. Well, I mean, that's the other. I mean, it's an Aji Kari as well, right? With um, the evasion, so Lifestealer has to build the Monkey King bar. We talked about this at the start. Um, hmm. Want the Magnus then for the uh, farm acceleration? Or. Five seconds left now. Joker. Oh, they can 1v1 Ursa. Bottom Assassin. Max Blur. Ooh, Radiant Team Ban. <sighs> Ah, uh, they ban the Magnus, Jeeves. They have to ban the Joker as well, then. It's 
not ideal versus life stealer, but I feel like it's gonna. Uh, it's about buffing the PA through. game, right, and getting her online fast. Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. Radiant team band. All right, take out the viper. It's the obvious counter for mid. Talking versus life stealer. Nah. This bull needs to turn his bot for the damage reduction. Come on, radiant team, you gotta pick him right. Wide spirit. I don't see how that buffs your PA, friend. I mean if you go solar crest, I guess. A save, a save. Alrighty, let's get into it for game two in the AMD Sapphire OGA Dota Pit China for E Home. X Nova on the Lena, SCC Life Stealer, Fade Earth Spirit, Chalice, Night Stalker, XM Outworld Decorator. For Royal, never give up. It's Satsu Void Spirit, uh, J on the Phantom Assassin, Super Omni Knight, Felix Chalba, Rubik, and Surf on the Mars. Felix is a god tier Rubik. I thought it was supposed to be 2 1 E home G. Um, I don't know. I feel like they have some problems. What's their, what's their trick for dealing with Super when he pops the Guardian Angel, though? So I guess S Triple C is going to build like a Monkey King bar and uh, a Nullifier. If they can get all that online in time. I think he's gonna win, Jeeves. Sure. I'm not sure they can get all of what they need to get online. And can they buy enough time for this level 18 PA? That's late. Etc. Right, Etc. Et Alrighty, what does the robot say? Four points. Draft advantage to E home. Yep, the Night Stalker. Refangled OD. Mm, there is a Mago as well. So, Frog. Well pleased with the bounty that has been put down on him by E home. Life Stealer. So he's going for basics, feelers, surf, six child bats, surf, and we're all down here. The burbs ward. Getting ready for the game to start in thirty seconds. Oh, I'm scared. Does the burb eat the ward right at the end when it runs out? That'd be best. Why is TA falling off lately? I feel like she's a good mid. Oh, TA is all about making a uh, fast Roshan potential with minus AC strat work. Um, she doesn't like being allowed he around heroes that are going to be able to break through her shield quickly. So Lena is a person who can break through her shield. Doom is pretty good against her as well. Um, 
Yeah, so if you see like a Drow line up, there's a good chance you end up with like the T emit. Or with a Slardar, you could end up with a T emit. Vengeful Spirit, T emit. These are times when TA is still going to be. Like sometimes with the Beastmaster Chen lineup as well, right? Because it enables an early Roshan. So I think OD does fairly well here, right? Once he gets a few levels versus sets, so he should be able to imprison on the range creep. Yeah, perfect. They have very similar colors though on the CS, quite annoying. 10th pick T8, yeah, yeah. If you get like Viper or something, it's just GG. You know. So Mr. J, he's got the new lane here. Got it all the way back here. Does leave his tire a little bit exposed, but super, he's gonna try and run the creeps around. Chalice, he's interfering with that. Meanwhile, Earth Spirit comes in. Oh no, here comes Chalice as well. Mr. J, gonna feel a little bit of pain right now. He's got a void, he's got a void to work with. He's happy to go for denies. In the meantime though, super, he brings the next wave of creep in here. All the action, all the time. And a much more aggressive lane, I have to say, down bottom. Look at this, 10 and 3, 7 and 0. These two guys hammering into the creeps here. Like, like there ain't no tomorrow. There ain't no today. Find tomorrow. More beer, boys, more beer. I'm juiced. He subs when he's juiced, boys, but only when he wins bets. Let's go. Phantom Assassin. Oh, a Wraith Band. <sighs> Heavenly Grace, not too useful, I have to say. Got Dagger CS here, though. Very nice, very nice. I, I feel like he's about to get murdered, so I want to stay and watch this, but... Same time, maybe he lives. No, let's go down. Fade will secure it. He was all out of juice, you know. No stick charges to speak of, really. All oh, the astral imprisonment. XM getting ready to shut this boy down. Nice rolling from Fade, keeping him there. The body blocks under the tower. Under the tower. He does get the kill back on Fade, though. Very nicely done. Very nicely done. Kill off fade first, so he gets the XP as well. PA Slarder is really good as well. I mean, PA is going to go uh, generally Battle Fury, Death, so BKB, right? Get level 18, start to kick ass. Start kicking ass before then. All it does is really accelerate you towards that peak power point faster. And uh, Surf actually starting to go a bit ahead here on the Mars. It's a bit of a... It's like a 50-50 lane, right? Nobody's going to die, really, unless the support's coming on in here. SCCC can munch on Surf consistently and keep his HP up. Surf never really takes too much damage anyway, being Mars. Alright, pinging out for the 5 minute bounty runes. Super making the long run down here. Lena, ex Nova on the high ground. Oh, they're getting set up for the Earth Spirit here. Oh, Fade, he's going to run. And he's only level 2, poor old Fade, but he will scoop the bounty rune. Nicely done. Charles going to get one as well. Should be 3 bounty runes then for Ehome. Bottle on XM, of course. All right, whiskey, now you're on the beer. Oh, well, you'll be getting less blitzed then. Less blitzed, boys, less blitzed.
More fluid, less alcohol percentage. Yep, got to keep stocked up on the whiskeys, boys. Scottish economy is not going to run itself. You're not drinking Scottish whiskey. The shame. The shame. So it's first night, Chalice is having a little go here. The missed chances, very nice, very nice. I guess they're gonna get Solar Crest though, right? Bloodthorn could be a thing as well. It's gonna be the meme hammer for the OD, which is gonna help out actually tremendously in those situations. A little bit of stun, a little bit of damage over time. Surf still, top of the bus for CS, but not by far. The SCCC able to munch on creeps, whatever he likes. Chasing in here, it's night time. Oh, the TP from Felix Child Bar though. Chalice gets spooked. Those crazy insectoid wings. No, it's Courier. Don't kill his Courier. No, it's Gumdrop Courier. Felix Child Bar. It's his time for the punch down, but back in under the tower. Chalice playing it safe for now. Alright, simply away. Okay, back up top. Still playing it safe. There's a roll forward though, they want to get initiated on, fade with a kick back into the light strike array, not too shabby, the punches are coming, here comes, oh, here comes Mr. J on X Nova, but Chalice, he already finished off Kuro Rubik, XM comes in, they want to deal with fade, not the biggest pick they could get there, Chalice level 6, still hovering in the lane, XM, heading back to mid it seems, keep on the way, 7 minutes after all, time for some neutral items, But the point is, Jay is now level 7, right? But he has crit, all of a sudden his daggers are a little bit threatening. Oh wow, look at this pool. 8.59. Stack Arena. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Fade, X, Nova, they know. See everything with this vision on this ward. Oh, they're gonna fight down bottom. No, they're fine, they're fine. Nobody's fighting. This is the fight right here. Look at this, three man radiant rotation in here. Oh, at the darkness, looking for super on the back side. The light striker Ray won't be there. He won't get it in time. Nice blink across actually. X Nova the one in trouble, super. Let's get a little bit of protection off there. Keeps himself alive for a few seconds. Surf for the TP in. Uh, that Fade is still just chilling in the trees here. Roll away. All right, Spidey Sense is not tingling. He'll get away successfully. Doesn't drink scotch, boys. Get him out. Get him out. So they do clear up on the dire side, on the radiant side even, clear out this creep camp. Oh, they might have taken him while well, Mars was there. Mars versus three. Oh, the silence. He's taking a lot of damage. Pops off the stick. Keeps himself frosty for now. He's got the arena. He's going to be barricaded in for just now. Felix is here. Setsu is here. Oh, Setsu, the cleanup. They take down the OD. Lose Mars in the progress. Chalice is the one who gets the kill on Super. And uh, Ehom. All the rage. Uh, I close the bats. I did not close them. Right. Cool. First 10 minutes, huh? A net worth lead on E home, 6 to 4.
All right, so we got Phase Boots, we got Bracer finished up on Night Stalker, Brown Boots for Rubik. Is he gonna go Aether Lens? I don't know what's coming here. Little Fade Bolt Tickle. XM has the Meme Hammer, Din, Distid, and Deliverud. Fade for the Tropical Boots, Full Wand, got his Basilius as well. Our Treads, Bracer for Mars. No Blink Dagger yet, huh? We'll break cheese, it's 10 minutes into the game, make it 11. X Nova, and booties, S triple C, still laying in bottom, huh? We'll be faced off versus J now. He's building a battle fury. Gaze to start things off. XM looking for initiation. Does jump forward. A little bit of counter play by X Nova though. Light strike array. He'll, he'll be protected. Phantom Assassin throwing the daggers. Doesn't get a good crit though. Crit denied on that one. XM, Meme Hammer with Chalice up top trying to take a tower of their own. Life Stealer feeling pretty fresh here. Feeling pretty brave. Uh, under they're here for him. What did he get? All the, rate, the open wounds. Decent. <laughs> Felix immediately goes rotating out of here. Ooh, and the power rune, I guess Void got it, right? Got the power rune. Oh, it's haste. It's on Mars. Alright, alright. This could be a good arena setup. They do need more protection, though. More boys. They're not going to fight it right now. Falling back, falling back. They've got a minute or two to use that history, so. Oh, wait, they're invading. Setsu's still here. Mars, the roll forward. Can he get there in time? He's not. He's oblivious just now. Setsu in prison for just now. Into the meme hammer. He's just dead. Mars is like, hey, what happened? Oh no, he was trying to stack some camps for himself and said they'll get feasted on, so will he. Felix Chalban from the side, X Nova ready with the light strike ray, the connection is there, Laguna Blade safe for now. Didn't have the mana, Jeeves. Waiting for that. Oh, Mars is lovely farm, gonna get stolen from him, fade the kickback. Ooh, the roll forward, now the lift up, can he get out of this arena? I don't think so. A big investment for an earth spirit, but they'll take it. It's a kill. It's something. Oh boy, Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Blue hurts my eyes to read. Well, these ones. Okay, our spirit's coming in. He's gonna go for the roll forward. Nice collection. Oh my god, the damage. It's incredible. He's just dead. What was that? That was insane. 365 from the void. Any HP? Does he have like a thousand? Yeah, not even a thousand HP. He needs a bracer, man. He doesn't drink tea. I just drink tea all the time, man. That's why it's like eight hours and I'm still like, yeah, this is fine. My voice is fine. Don't worry about it. We can go. We can go more. We can go eight hours tomorrow as well. All right, Setsu versus S Triple C. The roll from Fade, though. Once again, the Silence Light Strike Array connection. Laguna Blade, he's still alive throughout all of that. Nice play from Super, keeping his boys safe. Oh, Setsu. Oh, no, Super. The arena, though. Maybe he can survive if he gets out. No, he actually runs around the edge of the arena. S Triple C goes for the Rage TP. The back line, Lena is dead. It was Fade. Fade. 
is dead. Felix Chow Bop with a stolen Laguna Blade. Nice. Their names. What, Setsu? Or uh, Jaggernaut and Tinky Cat. <laughs> oh, nice. Nice Gorge Buke. Nice Spear. Surf showing them how we do with the double damage. And first to 10k betters are sweaters. What is the robot fight of all this? Jeez. Well, he is thinking E home. But maybe a Ricardo flick back now. Yep, 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 yep. There's the OD flick. There is the OD flick. The health bar is blue. It's red here and green here. What are you talking about? Oh, you can't see my cursor. It doesn't help. Okay. Smoking. Let us go. Let us go. Smoking. Who are we going to find? Night Stalker. Good pick, actually. Fantastic. Very good value if they can find it. It's difficult. It is night time. It's night time. It's not going to be the easiest pick for them to pick up here. What else could you find? The Life Stealer. That's an option. That's an option. Setsu. He'd be the one to be able to scout it out we go he sees him he's got the step available let's triple c panics a little bit the silence comes out now the aether into the laguna the stolen laguna it's there that's a kill s triple c is dead all right x nova he's got his arcane boots finished up Setsu with an Aghanim Scepter, by the way. Oh, here we go. A little bit of lane shark in. Nice. Look at that fade bolt damage. Felix Chalba crushing him. Setsu getting the CS, of course. Very nicely played. Look at this, though. All right. Okay. 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 It was mostly voice, but it was mostly voice, but... Talking about mostly voice, spirit of the blink out. He is all magnetized up. Oh, nice hammer drop. Good night, Omni. Good night, PA. Now it's time for Surf to be bullied here a little bit. Fade with a roll in. Oh, wow. The, the, the roll pass. I don't know. S Drop C here is now as well. Surf getting hit in the back with pure damage. Feels bad, man. And E home. Now 6k up. 12 to 10. Who got first to 10 kills, though? I feel like RNG for sure. Meet the tower down, meet the tower down, no problemo. We roll forward from fade. Wait a minute, that's a telekinesis. That is an XM with a point step forward. He's dead. Okay, S Triple C though, the turn right. That he's all silenced up, all bang up. He's still a unit. He's dead. And I mean Felix Chaba got blitzed on the outside there as well during all of that. I think he got hit like three or three or four times right clicked, and that was all she wrote, basically. I think so. How many HP does he have? Only one thousand. Oh my god, dude, it's 18 minutes into the game and everyone has like a thousand HP. So Mr. J, he is level 12. This is this is a good point for him to be. He doesn't have the battle for you yet. That's a bad point for him to be at. Um, <clears throat> he can pick it up. He just needs to get to the secret shop. But will the radiant movement on the map allow him to be able to complete this move? And he thinks he can get away with it now. Goes for the battle fury. Now he needs to get level 18. He needs to get his death. So he needs to get his BKB. He has a few minutes to get this done. Roche situation right now. It's not been taken yet. Aegis is available. Setsu. He's here with Felix Chaoba. They're patrolling the river. Bounty rune exchange. Actually going rather RNG favoured. They're getting four. No, XM scoops one. He'll get two. I think someone must have a shovel. Here's some more runes. 
Yo, Charles has got his BKB finished up. He'll be the first to get the nullifier. The Monkey King bar coming out on Lifestealer. Yeah, I did wonder this because Charles ch tends to get a decent amount of farm uh, when, in the draft when we saw it. He tends to get a decent amount of farm when it comes to the Night Stalker. But it means Night Stalker plus Lifestealer have to focus EA, right? Let's go, munch bunch time. Take down this tower. Give it the old uh, the old drill down. Surface here with the blink dagger BKB. Queued up. I wonder what they're gonna build. You're still dead, huh? How is Night Stalker top net worth? He's got Midas, mate. He's got Midas. Also, he's four zero and four. I don't know if you noticed that. Here we go, pop off the darkness, they go blinking, they go hunting, he's already gone though, I mean if it's Mars, he's miles away. Do they go for Roche now? They, uh, do they have a medallion? Aetherlands here, I mean he's got Monkey King Bar, he should be able to wreak enough damage. Uh, it's going down pretty fast I have to say. No real response from the Dire, wait they're smoke jeez, they're responding, just it's the slowest response. I guess they're expecting Roche to take longer, right? And immediately, immediately just hold the high ground, just back things up a bit. Know about this Observer Ward. Can't get to it right now, though. It's daytime, there's no darkness available. Um, three minutes where probably E Home don't push too hard. They just use this Aegis to farm up. You go the Aegis. Yeah, yeah. Aegis for life stealing. 11k net worth lead right now, yep. There we go, the Mars Arena. This is a little bit aggressive. XM, they try to pick lead on the backside, but there will be a protective bubble put down by OD. Kick away from Fade. Now, Felix Chaba in the river. He's going to get magnetized solo. He's pretty much dead, I imagine. No real escape there. Wait, wait, Chalice. They're looking for more. Super, he's all slowed up. XM in on top of him. Super. Tries for the heal bomb. Tries for a little bit of the... Divine protection there. A little bit of the heavenly grace does not come through. Double kill for Chalice. And it's super pacey from Evil. Getting a little bit more out of this than they should have otherwise. Gonna save the buy box on the supports. The tier 3 tower, they do have a fortification, so I imagine they use it before things get too grim. Yep, there it is. But otherwise, you're quite happy if you're e home right now. Your Aegis Gambit has paid off. You got a mid tower as well as some kills. A supreme amount of damage on the tier 3, by the way. And then, you, I mean, bottom, you just have to be looking bottom going as five, right? No, they go smoked instead. They want to, They want more kills. They want more pickoff potential. They want an easy uphill push and look super dead. All right, easy pick. Number one, now looking for more. The Mars Arena, though, things getting a little bit spicy. Chalice, he's lifted up. Uh, no, he's not. That's fade, dude. Now the Guardian Angels, they can steal that if they want it, but they won't. It's fine. You can't steal it, Chiefs, because on that side. Yeah, I knew that. I, knew, I was just testing you guys. So, I mean, what did they lose there? They got the buyback, right, from Omni. Yeah, because he bought back for the Guardian Age. But they do lose their, uh, their Earth Spirit. Once he gets BKB, he can make that play a lot easier. Roche not going to be a factor for quite some time. They still have the Aegis. I feel like they want to push bottom, but at the moment, Dyer are all there ready to defend that kind of wing. And it's mostly about getting old Phantom Assassin to level 18. She is level 16. The Desolator's in hand. PKB. Once they have that item online, this game, it's a shift in the power spike or whatever you want to call it. The thing is, SCCC is ready for this. He's going to have an Assault Curas, he's got a Monkey King Bar already, he's got the Armlet for extra attack speed. He is re <laughs> he's ready for this. He can still die at crits though. Still die at crits. 
That's you TPing out. Negatory, the stun, no problemo. Chalice leaps in on top, gives them the old silencer roof. Fade there, nice. Open wounds and a net. XM. Night, night, sweet prince. What's the Roche timer left? 1 minute 16 seconds left on this Aegis, by the way. Alright, so you lost your you lost your Void Spirit. He's down for 42 seconds. He's got no buyback. What's the buyback situation? He's pretty close, actually. They got this bounty rune here top. He's got buyback. I think it's worth the mission. Felix. Felix. The Felix. Felix will Dead. Never mind. Never mind. Die back on super. Die back on super. Three, eight, three rocks, boys. Oh, that was a pretty good spear, but the banishment is what, kind of instant. OD though. OD. Damn. Damn. OD is down. Laguna Blade does not pay off. Does get bubbled up at the last second by. I guess Rubik saved his balls, huh? Does Rubik saved PA's balls, guys? Nice, the spear will connect. Set, see the damage is there. And on top with the PA, he needs a bash, he needs a bash, he needs a bash. He doesn't have a bash for Jeeves, this guy does. Uh, he doesn't. Oh, well, he's dead anyway. This is a pretty good defense. They should kind of take out the catapult, though. And RNG will hold the high ground fairly convincingly. They lost the PAG. I know, but look, they got the Night Stalker, the OD, Life Stealer. It's a pretty good swap. It's a pretty good swap overall. I don't know, I think RNG dismantled um, Magma, right? But, I mean, here's E-Home playing versus RNG. And they're 14k up, game two. 21 to 14. I'm actually quite impressed with uh, X Nova's performance on Alina. Like, given his ping issues, his light striker rates haven't been too bad. That's who's down here. He's got his BKB. 10 seconds. First reveal. Paladin sword for both teams. Very nice. Here you go, sir. Oh, the orbit distraction's pretty good, though. Orbit destruction for. Night Stalker, yeah. Oh, he's got his nullifier finished up. Charles is such a beast on this hero. Like people talk about his Bloodseeker, but honestly, his Night Stalker is quite furious. Well, oh, casual level 19 boys. He's getting a basher. I wouldn't be too um, adverse to him getting Monkey King Bar. Oh. But what if you've got a life stealer inside you with Monkey King Bar? That's how you perfectly combo it together and make sure they're always there, Jeeves. Yo, I never thought of that. Alright, we got a little bit of a smoke play here. The darkness goes off up to the high ground. Let's go searching. There's Setsu. Felix Chao Bot. Where? Felix Chao who? Felix Chao who? Oh, Charles giving the old slap daddy down. They'll force the fortification. 37 seconds, no Felix. He does have buyback. Oh my god, look how fast they take ranged. I mean, they can continue to siege here. S Triple C. The creep wave is so far away, though. They need mid creep wave. They should have pushed bottom so long ago. Roshan spawning very soon, by the way. No, I don't think uh, Seeker are behind with the pace or the man. I think they just don't care. Oh, I either they know when Ti is and they want to kill their name. Yeah.
Oh no, they're just not. I wouldn't bet on them. I wouldn't bet on them now. It feels like they're all random every game now. I wouldn't bet on Secret right now. I mean, they're obviously still phenomenal players, but are they trying today? Who knows? It's the same thing as TI, man. It's the same thing as TI. Everybody's watching you. Everybody's looking at all your heroes. Everybody's looking at all the counters. Yo, this is a huge ass smoke coming in from RNG. And S Triple C is going to put down the slapping. Oh my god. Felix Chalmaz is dead set. So you're getting handled by Chalice now. Controlled up. Kept in place. Has managed to get out. A little bit of invis action on the backside. Those serve for the BKB going off now as well. Chalice, the TP out. Can they stop him? No. No bash, Chalice. That's important, yeah, Chiefs. Bought it. But Roche is up the stage. It's cheese. It's Christmas time for e -home. Twenty four K net worth. Oh, the roll forward. Nice catch. I mean, he just solo killed the Omni Knight. I, I, I cost him magnetism. That's the magnetism. What did Felix get here? He got the rolling boulder. Oh, shit. S Triple C's in there. He's eating this tower. He's eating this tower down. Munch, 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 munch. Sarf comes in with a spear plate. Nice. Plink in from the. Wow. Okay, PA level 20, by the way, starting to throw down some serious DPS. That's a dead Night Stalker. Oh, set to the bait. The baiting is happening. PA looking for a way in here. The bomb gets dropped on the backside. Super. Ah, mate. Ah, mate. It's not ah, mate. It's Jay. Jay now getting bashed up. Oh, no. The Abyssal. Oh, no. The Monkey King bar. I mean, S Triple C built the whole game to uh, to deal with the PA, right? So that would be a little bit surprising if the PA was to actually pop off. Look at this! Look at this! Plus twenty four armor. Yeah, there's the GG two O for E Home. Couldn't even make it a two one. Nah, TI pool is 40 million right now. It's like, I know, 25 million for first place. Pretty good, my friends. Pretty good. 5 million each. Uh, 29 to 15. What can we say about this game? Chalice, MVP, obviously. Uh, superior Night Stalker play there. Enter and take note. I love that nullifier build. And the only reason he builds it, well, it's not the only reason, but it's the Guardian Angel, right? And then at the same time, S Triple C, he goes pretty much first item after Armlet into Monkey King Bar. So Phantom Assassin, she has this peak, right? But before she can reach her peak, these two are already coming in here with a nullifier and the Monkey King Bar. It's just, she never actually gets that point where she has the game. And uh, yeah, like I say, it was it was a tall order for it just to all be on the life stealer, but Chalice coming in there pretty sweet. I have to say with a night stalker, making it happen, Jeeves, making it happen. All right, so the next series. Magma versus Vici Gaming.
team fan. Whew, radiant team fan. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, let's go. AMD Software, OGA, Dota Pit, China, Vici Gaming versus Team Magma, Game Two, uh, Game One, uh, Series Two. You I am um, General Jeevikis. The draft it's underway. I Goodbye, Bloodseeker. First phase bond again. Seconds left. Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. Get rid of the Io. Will we see Undying? No, we won't see Undying. Will we see Mars? Could see Mars. You're playing versus Magma. What hero in particular do you want to ban? Yeah, your coins are coming along now, Sean. Dire team pick. Alina. Come on, Rainy Team, you gotta pick them right. Alright, so no real surprise there. They pick the Mars up first. They're gonna pick the Rubik Jeeves, they're gonna get the Chen. I think he won the Dry Ranger, right? Go dire team. Not Go first. Phoenix is good, yeah. Magma get the Rubik. You, you, you really gotta pick a hero. You got 10 seconds left. Um, you, you, you What's really good versus Phoenix? Right? Mirana, maybe, right? Yeah. yeah. Right. I think they want the Rubik. Steal the Moonlight Shadow, you can steal the arena. Uh ten seconds to pick your hero. What about the clockwork as well? Clock could be an option. It's pretty good with the Phoenix. Yeah, five seconds left now. If they want to build towards the drought lineup, they gotta think about Oh, they're going Sven. We have the drought, boys. Drought is out. I guess Phoenix is kind of good versus like a Chen. Would you ban the Chen because Sven is there, though? You, you really gotta pick a hero. What you other accelerator can you get for this bad boy? Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. Oh, the Dark's here, right? Beastmaster. All right, because of the chance fan implication. Chance fan plus Beastmaster, quite the poo. It's a lot of space, man. Oh, man. Rick, only ten seconds left to pick a hero. Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. Dire team ban. Draw Ranger. They ban the drought. Well, yeah, of course. Cause they have the Mirana, right? And the Mars. That already has good tango. Good setup for Dry Ranger. And now you have the Sven. You have no need. Or uh, track six. Ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Oh, early bets going you, in. You, you better pick your hero. Five seconds. Gaming.
Earth Spirito. Yo, I can't wait to see Erica today. I imagine he's going to be on fire again. I want to see some big numbers here. Uh, 10 seconds to pick your hero, you moron. How'd you stay on top of Murana, though? Yeah, five he needs the darks here. He needs maybe the Ogre Magi. Oh, dire team fan. Gonna ban out the Granny, so that takes that factory. It's a little bit more random, though, right? Getting thrown in by Granny. It's not exactly controlled hunting. More of an Erica kind of situation, I think. Oh man, Rick, there's only ten seconds left to pick a hero. Five seconds more. Nah, with well, the fun. eighty Rick, hours, Dental Dom, one hundred and forty-two hours, seven hundred and twenty-seven coins. Boy, oh boy. Like yeah, there's five seconds left now. Come on, Radiant Team, you gotta pick him right. All right, we ditched the back news. They gonna go, where are they going to go for a Magma? They like the CK, right? But CK versus Sven doesn't feel too good. Did they play the PL? I think they played the PL, but PL versus Sven isn't too good. What about Morphling? You, you really got to pick a hero. You got 10 seconds left. Um, you, you, you better pick your hero. I feel like you have to have someone who's really good with Morphling before you can play Morphling, though. And Spirit Vessel is going to be a thing. They get the Rubik in the end anyway. It's a pretty nice pickup. Like I say, the Mars Arena, the Moonlight Shadow, good amount of Tangle. Stolen Arrow, boys. Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Radiant team pick. Eugar Magi. So, Faceless Void? What else can they go here? PA, they can go PA, but then Sven is going to come along pretty fast. Sven. Oh man, Rick, there's only 10 seconds left to Joker? Yeah, there's five seconds left now. I mean, Ori does like the OD. Is the OD good here? Pretty good for catching Mirana. And Mars not particularly smart. Ogre is an intelligence human. Wham bam, thank you, ma'am. This is much quicker. This gives you chase from Mirana. Uh, it's not threatened by Mars. Neither is Phoenix, really. Rubik's probably going to steal Leap, so. Only one really threatened by Arena is Sven. I imagine Sven gets, like, Echo you, you really Saber into you Silver Edge to deal with the Mars. Um, uh, you, you, use their core, though. We're about to find out. And saving Old Eleven's pick for last. I mean, you can flex void on team. We need two Jeeves. No, I don't think so. Um, Embersoft could be a shout here. Messing with the Mars, what's want, what Mars wants to do with Arena. It messes with the Lifestealer. Like Chakra's always pure damage, but I don't know if it Five pierces spell me. They take out the Slardar. They take out the Slardar. Right, because they have the Mars. You don't want to see no can opener when Mars is in play. They take out the OD themselves, because they already have Void Spirits, a pretty good matchup. 
Disco Stew is still available though, so I imagine that's the next ban for VG Gaming, and then Templar Assassin for Magma? Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero Templar Assassin versus Phoenix on. though. An Echo Saber Sven, maybe not. It'll be fine. E? Team ban. The Omni? Sure, offlane Omni is a thing. Been rather delightful. You can still play Phoenix offlane and pick up Chen. Don't have much way for the I mean they got the God's Rebuke, they got the Starfall. Knight's not bad. Uh ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Um you 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 better pick your hero. Five seconds. What did I say they needed to ban here, Jeeves? I don't know. I'm sure it wasn't important. Oh, I was thinking the TA, right? Oh, I was thinking they would pick the TA. What about, what's another vehicle for life to get? Storm Spirit? What do they have for catch? Sven, Thunder Hammer, Storm Hammer, even Rubik Lift. Oh, Disco Stew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The band of Disco. Storm Spirit Jeeves. PA just feels a little bit rough first as the Phoenix fan, right? Damn, Jeeves. That's, uh, that, I mean, that's, you got quite a lot of the draft right there. Oh, man. Rick, there's only very, very the good. Five seconds more um, the final pick here. So they do need an offlaner that can deal with Storm, right? At some point. Or lie steal. I mean, don't. Overlord. Meh. Tide Hunter. I'm up for some Tide, boy. Enigma. Mm. Okay. Alrighty, let's go. Game one, best of three in the AMD Sapphire OGA Dota Pit China for Avicii Gaming, DY, Phoenix, Erica on the Sven, PY, and W Rubik, Ori Void Spirit, and Old Eleven Enigma. Or Team Magma. TZY Mars, Chinese Guy Marana, Kaz on the Yoga Magi, ZC on the Storm Spirit, and Blank Blank on the Lifestealer. I am General G because follow me at Twitch TV slash Jeeves Dota TV. Let's get our Dota on. Oh, Jeeves, who do you think is going to win? I think VG Gaming are going to slam it. I don't know. ZC Storm, though. Good. Oh, the Shadow One and Priest of FSM, they like Magma. They like what Magma are throwing out here. Ojahines, Renegades, Fraud, they're going in. What is... Chinese Black Hole, boys. Old Eleven Black Hole. Old Eleven Black Hole. Nice, 17 and 3, his last uh, 20 win matches there. Getting his behavior scored up, boys. Magma. Uh, I went for VG Gaming. Oh, 
What does the robot say? The robot says four points draft advantage to Vici Gaming. Is it mango flavored? Feels mango flavored. Chiefs is not mango flavored. I repeat, I repeat, mango advantage going to the radiant. Come on, watch the game delayed when you're watching it in real time. I don't think so, Timothy. So uh, my daughter found the uh, the outdoor golf balls, you know, for crazy golf and whatnot. And uh, that was a paranoia-inducing 30 seconds, I'll tell you what. She came through the living room with all the screens, and I was like, oh my god. I'll throw them to you. No, 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 it's cool. Just pass them to daddy. So, a little bit of early invasive aggression from Magma here, flowing over the radiant side like a wave. Molten steel. Yo, Phoenix. Be white. Guy. For the warding. Oh, I guess a little information there. You see that? So Erica going for the long block, but it's not too tight here. Still keeping it kind of loose. Long block coming through from the side of Magma. Marana one captaining that field of crap, eh? I did the block go in the mid lane. It looks like it was already favored. Pretty expected, to be honest. He's a good blocker. And TZY with the little spin there at the end. It's pretty good. It's pretty good to take the range CS there. Looks like he did. Uh, to deny as well, Erica being frustrated early here in the lane. Mars is an exceptional laner for an offlaner. He has many tricks through the CS. He'll gauge buke the spear. Oh shit, the bets, Chiefs, the bets. Oh no, the auto, it connects up. Magma 4, Vici Gaming 8. Some believers on both sides of the fence right now. D, why are you going to be first, but He's fine, Chiefs, he's fine. E tours you you guys don't even know, don't even know about it yet. Six and one versus five and what? Six and zero oh versus five and one. Seven and zero. Oh. Pretty even on CS in the mid lane. Easy white doing a good job of both taking CS and threatening this fan right now. Storm is going ahead though. ZC, I think ZC Storm is ringing some alarm bells for me. Hey, jeez, don't be sleeping on the ZC Storm Spirit. Those kind of alarm bells. And Ori, he's getting, he's getting kind of, he's getting a little bit handled there right now. I mean, he's got tangles to work with. Got a cheeky fairy fire as well. Rana building. Oh. Building Wraith Band. Mars is building Bracer. Mask of Man is first time for Sven though. He feels chonky enough, he feels tanky enough versus the crit lane. And the arrow. I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. Saw the pace that they were able to get it out before though, right? That Mask of Man is Sven super early, like. Maybe it's not too bad if you get the lifesteal first. A lot of money you have to save up though. Making some investments, G. The investments. So the reason I think this lane should go old eleven favored is pretty much why it's going old eleven favored right now. What? But he's got only ten CS or eleven CS. Yes, but look at his denies, bro. I mean, he wants to push the life stealer away for this range CS, right? So he gets him out of range. So that when he eats the CS here, oh no, he's no, yeah, look, yeah, he's blocking the creep wave. He keeps it in control. He doesn't want life stealer close because he's going to eat this CS here. He doesn't want to give him the shared CS. Um, from the range creep, end up giving him level three. I don't know, dude. Erica's so good, man. And uh, lately, it feels like he always has something to prove. But as he takes down our courier, just as we have a little look at him, he always has something to prove, right? So he's always he's playing super top notch to us. which makes the argument for replacing him with uh, 23 Savage a little bit poorer, because. 
at least 23 Savage, he's playing in tournament, right? Um, he's doing C tournament, some C tournament. So at least he's he's being stretched, you know? At least the old muscles are being used. So that was a sweet deny there. Four minute runes, rotation, Rubik is in place for uh, for the Radiant side here. ZC, the Fade Bolt, the lift up, nice. Still level four. Oh wow, DY's here now as well. A few extra right, right click, ZC dead for sure. Kaz comes in. Double damage secured by Mirana. Where is she? Where, where's Mirana? All right. Oh, oh, DY, oh, why, oh, why. Hi, it's me, Mirana. I have three leaps to chase you, bro. How are you feeling? Oh, waits for the arrow, misses the arrow. DY, he jukes, but he still, he dives away. One more arrow. Oh! Indeed, indeed. Lineup, do I think I'll get first to 10 kills? Um, the magma lineup, right? Unless they do something crazy with old 11. But I don't see everyone being in the same place at the same time, so. This fan, he needs his mask of madness. He's got his morbid mask. Ah, he does have his, he does have his morbid mask, but he went for that for a bracer. Yeah, there's no way. There's no way you can face off on the Mars lane just with naked mask of madness, morbid mask. You need something. You need a little chunk. You know? DY get, takes care of this deep ward here. Already trying to mess with ZC just a little bit here. What's the CS looking like? 28 and 6 versus 33 and 5. Level 6 coming up on Ori when this catapult goes down. I feel like the catapult goes down for the other side first. Yeah. Here we go. He gets to level 6. He goes forward. He's got plenty of mana to work with. DY trying to come in with the save to simulate. Oh, he didn't actually go anywhere with it. Smart. Sven's dead. Sven's dead. I mean, I want to stick on this fight because I think stuff's still happening, but Sven is dead. Sven is dead. Spear, God's Rebuke, Arrow from downtown. Bam, catches him beautifully. Yeah. Oh, we saw it. We saw it. We saw it. I wasn't even a black hole. 100% of the kills, 100% of the time, boys. Um, level 6, Enigma, 39 and 29. Holy shitballs. He has more denies than Lifestealer has CS. Lifestealer having probably the worst light lane of his life. He's like, there's no kills. I've not died, everything's fine, but you just get sapped every time. Yep. Oh, he didn't take the range to yes, though. Okay, okay, tease. Why the comeback kill? It's down bottom here. The arena and everything was used there. What happened? So he thinks he's got the Sven this time. The hammer. DY sitting right on top of the Mirana. Mirana getting toasted in amongst all this. Pulling back in because here comes Ori with the gaze. And Mirana diving away to safety, huh? Mirana gets out alive. Typical. So now he has the black hole online, you have to start respecting the Enigma. This uh, lifestealer is still level 5. For another half level, wow, he is behind. He'll catch up. Excellent view of the towers, I drank my tea there. Very impressive. Ah, uh, Mask of Madness done for Sven, have we got any stacks camped? Any, any camps stacked at all? No. No stacks camped. Oh, good arrow connection. Is he dead? I think he's dead. Decent range on it. Invis to refuel the ball. ZC Storm coming online. Getting activated. Old 11. Well, Tally's on the old, uh, the old Midas, eh? Why? An arcane ring for Storm Spirit now? Oofed. Oofed. 
11 holding the ocean heart. Ori has faded brooch. Very nice item for him. Level 6 finally achieved on Life Stealer Diamond Bottom. Another fight, Jeeves. You gotta keep an eye on these things, you know? You gotta keep an eye on them. There's the first black hole. It's very good. So, I mean, they trade Phoenix for Lifestealer across the map. The towers will probably both fall down. Mars is top of the bus for CS. The farm, Jeeves. Damn. On one and one with a bracer. Looking for Blink Dagger. He's got a few hundred gold to go. Dude, top tower fell first. Not well, anything to really defend it with, though. ZC's starting to go a little bit ham himself. Building Orchid first item. Oh, yo, DY. Go oh, level 5. Way to go! Power finally falls. Plank is in the jungle, farming up, looking for Midas. Ooh. Don't know about that one. An old 11 was just kind of AFK shopping there, I think. Looking for Midas, he's looking for Armlet. I don't know how arm, I could arm it feels actually in a black hole, but we'll see. Nice play from CC though. The arrow connects up nice and good for Ori as well. He's dead. Again. Rana spells doom. By W, what did he get? The fire blast, not bad. Only deep. One, two, three. Thank you follow. Keep it clean. Keep it PMA. Here comes the Mars Arena. The spear in. That's a, that's a dead Rubik. Like Shadow comboed up with it as well. They don't care. They'll just use ults for anyone right now. Yeah, no spoilers, please, Johnny Deep. No spoilers, sir. Building Echo Saber, huh? Oh. All right. Rana. I mean, she's got Wraith Bunch, she's got Brian Boots, she's looking for the Yule Scepter. Bye, Kaz. We saw it, guys. We saw it. 100% of the kills, 100% of the time. Gives it a TV experience. Uh, ZC. Building, building the old, uh, the old silent stick. The old Orchid Malevolence. Enigma in the jungle. Enigma in the jungle. How's this Midas? Link Dagger. They have BKB piercing disable. Not really. The arrow could be a bit of a problem though. Definitely see that being able to stop the The arrows have been super good. They definitely will stop uh, Enigma with arrow at some point. Yeah, Magma are no slouches. They are no slouches. They don't have much to handle ZC Storm Spirit either. Especially with this early orchid coming online, so I imagine we could see some fun times. We could see some fun times. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. What does he have right now? Uh, the bloodlust, pretty good actually, pretty good. Do that on your void spirit, pumps him up, gives him some uh, extra attack speed, extra formation. Same for your Sven. I mean, if I was Rubik, I'd be just going straight for Sven right now. I'd be like, yo, Sven, 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 yo, Sven, Sven, Sven. I have this buff for you, sir. Yep. EYW listening to stream, confirmed. All right, Storm of Spirit looking for, uh, looking for Orchid. Jazz Daddy, he's got himself Tranquil Boots full on Wand, building Aether Lens. Raindrops for Enigma, huh? Who are they trying to get here? Because it's working. No Moonlight Shadow, they are smoke. They see the Rubik, they're like, hmm, maybe not. Ori shows, breaks the smoke on Mirana. They go for a smoke of their own. Very intriguing. Much cloak and dagger. And I mean, old 11's smoke was never actually broken. Time just ran out. Both teams playing super cagey right now. They're quite content for their lifestealer farm, remember? He is super far behind. Middle 
The longer it takes for Radiant to make a move, the happier Dyer are. They need to catch up on this guy. If they catch Storm Spirit, though, that's pretty big. It's pretty big. He's got a lot of mana to work with here. Catching him. That's not seem likely. Wait, they'll bring the Sven over as well. Now the Moonlight Shadow. I hope you brought dust, sir. The gay is not going to stop him. Oh, he's out of there. Oh, they're fighting mid. Or they're thinking about it. The Moonlight Shadows, they come in on top of the tower. DY, what's your play here? He has an egg. ZC going zip -de zip -de zip -de doo da We'll not find anything. The steal up. Mars, he went a little bit too deep here. He's taunted for a few seconds. TZY, the spear. Throw him away. Nice. Now the dive forward. The tower's still standing. Sunray, it connects. Storm Hammer to hold him in place. They're melting, they're melting. TZY throws out the arena, gets the to safety, the back line initiation, but look, here comes the egg. Murana dealt with before they can pop it. They'll take two, make it three as they look for ZC as well. Now he's out of mana. And Erika stomping forward. He says, let's see if we can get any more fortification. And then take the tower down. How much longer left on God strength? A decent time, they can go for Roche maybe. Mars is up here. Mars is up here. Oh, he's going to find him. Okay. Blink away. Mass TP's coming in. Down bottom. Don't want to stick around too long, but long enough to secure the bounty runes. Oh, they got, they got the arrow. They've got no arena for now. No moonlight shadow. Or oh, he goes back in. Fire blast into the face. Now the arrow connection. The follow up with the with the star fall. He's trying to dissimulate away. He goes up back there. Around the outside. Good save. ZC is going to find him. The Yule Scepter. He's got one more play in it. But no. He's down. ZC chasing forward. Looking for a plus one. It's PYW. He does, does have ball lightning. Not much mana to work with. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Here comes Enigma. Here comes Enigma. The frustrations. The fortification comes out. The arena. Is it ready for Mars? It must be a few seconds, right? Six seconds and it's up. Enigma looking for the ideal black hole avenue. It's a difficult one. It's a difficult one. All five heroes are here. No. Phoenix can get speared up. PYW got the ball lightning out there. At least the silence forever. He's dead. Enigma now. Three men in the black hole target area. Not able to capitalize on it. Old 11 says, no, I'm good. I'll get my BKB first. First 10 kills. 8 to 8 right now. First 10k betters are sweaters. Gonna be... Expecting the storm to kick off a little bit harder, to be honest. We almost had the old 11 black hole set up there. He had a little bit of the fear though. He was worried he was going to get countered like the rage was going to come through. Um, that won't save you from black hole though, right? No. Okay, the set up here for Mirana. The stolen arrow goes literally nowhere. I guess he was expecting him to leap, right? Could have been a play of the week, but instead... More like a fail. Alright, ZC and it's cars. They've got pretty good assault down here. They don't have much tower poke though. Heroes they can jam with um powers not so much. Alright, DY, a little bit exposed here. They know exactly where he is. Or are you gonna come in and help him out a little bit? EYW, nice. Mars Arena, ZC, the arena, the egg on the backside. Kaz is melting down. He's dead before the egg pops off. They get the stun on the Storm Spirit as well. Good timing here. Still has mana to work with. The rest of the squad are here. Storm Hammer goes through. By the way, nice Yules up in Arrow combo. He's getting flamed by the Lifestealer inside and the Ancient Creep right now. A little bit of a shield wall. Not often we get to see this. The BKB turnaround from Erika. He goes for the God Strength now as well. Chunking in a TZY on the backside here. The bull works, keeping him safe for a few more seconds. Or he will finish him off. ZC, he's got a little bit of mana to work with. No problemo. Now the black hole it catches two. In fact, Marana runs into it. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. First to 10 kills. Vici Gaming secured by the black hole. 
Um, not really. I think about a little bit of gold strength. Yeah, but think of the double damage. So you had a little bit of quad damage into this, or even for the Aegis himself, I think. By helping out some boys. A little abrasive. He doesn't have tranquil boots. Just bad to be Sunray Spammer with no tranquil boots on uh, Phoenix, let me tell you what. Give it to Sven then? No, it does definitely go wrong. I think this is perfect, right? It allows him to initiate and it's all about making plays, right? The first Aegis is about making plays, taking outer towers where you actually have high ground advantage in some assaults. Um, well, the secondary Aegis, you offlaner or carry, right? Because you want to be hitting towers. It depends how farmed and ready you are to go with the high ground. Uh, the BKB is done for Sven. That's a nine seconds. We did see it get used in that last fight. Enigma's BKB is done as well. Just waiting for it to be delivered. He doesn't have black hole for 90 seconds, so only able to push him with Eidolons for now. And I think it's a great idea that they stick together because Enigma's kind of vulnerable at the moment. Lifestealer progress. Let's have a look and see. He has Midas. He has uh, armlet and phase boots. Not too shabby. TZ5 with the Blink Dagger, of course. BKB coming. Kind of key BKB on all the heroes, I think. Yeah, look at this. He has Orchid, but he is looking for BKB. What else is he looking for, though? Oh, that's the BKB. And Ikaya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, who's fighting, by the way? I don't even know. I hear the battle music. People are getting ready. Smoke. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, the zip initiation is here. They catch out Puro already. Break that age. Just look at he split. Phoenix is there with the sun ray. They're all TPing out. Just a quick pick. It's just a quick pick and it's all over. It's been like Shadow though, I mean, Black Hole is up, you just, uh, 10 seconds, Jeeves. Oh, Black Hole's not up. Sven Daddy has the Echo Saber looking for Silver Edge. We talked about how he was going to use this to beast down Mars. Although it's a toggle ability now, thinking. Whoa, Dyer's bottom tower's under attack. Oh great, Dyer's bottom tower just got destroyed. Alright, they are smoking. They are going. Let's go. Let's go smoke go. Where are they going? Was it Mirana's here? I mean, Mirana's as good a pick as any. Yeah, well, I mean, they'll start off with the Yules, the Sunrays there, the leap away, the, the Storm Hammer catching him. He's dead. All right, job done. Start taking tier two tower, trading for tier one. Fortification gonna make things a little bit miserable for life stealer to start off with, but fortification on fortification action. Life stealer's just here for the creeps, my dudes. Phoenix is already there. He wants to try and defend the tower. I mean, he doesn't need defending. He's not making a serious push at this. Erica with the double damage slays those uh, ancient creeps. Easy peasy. Phoenix has Glimmer Cape now. Looking for Lotus Orb. Pretty good versus Ogre Magi. Like, whenever he casts any spell, there's a good chance we're going to reflect something, right? So, I accept her for Sven at the moment. I feel like it's good here. Ax, uh, Abyssal, right? Of 
We're gonna knock Scepter up on Void Spirit, PYW. Looking for a four staff, already has Aether Lens, decent range available on him. TP, you might want to leave, sir, because there's a mean life stealer coming to eat your face. So life stealer goes abyss uh, goes basher even into Oh Kuras. BKB for him. I mean he has rage. Oh, Sven with the popping off of the BKB super early there. Oh. Okay, well, I mean, they know, they know they can take a fight right now. Yeah, look at this. They're looking for kills up top. All right, the Yules, but they go for that back line. Old 11 is ready with a beautiful black hole. He's not got enough damage. He needs a little bit help here. ZC, he's getting his ass out of there. Popped off his BKB in time. Easy why not so lucky. What a great black hole that was, by the way. Kaz is just dead, of course. Ben is here now. Erika starting to push in. 9k net worth lead. Get the tower down. Yeah, I think you're losing the momentum. That kind of pace and momentum that we were looking for from Magma. The Storm Spirit, he's not doing badly, but he's not popping off either. He's 3-3-3. Three, three, and three. Okay, okay, I mean they find his carty. Oh no. Oh Sven, I like this play. I like this play a lot. Alright, they get PYW. Ben is super deep right now. I don't like it anymore. Okay, 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 okay. Four hits to kill the Ogre Magi. Carty's coming back. He's back again. Do 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 do. Alright, it's Gucci, it's Gucci, Sven, he's hunting, he's still got the god strength up, oh it's gone now. He's a lifestealer, you see him on the lane, but ZC, he's the one they'd rather get, oh look at this, look at this. Oh, on the low ground, he says, oh are you going to find him, I can't see him. ZC, there's the chase though, will you bait him out, the arrow comes forward, they were ready for that, Chinese guy jumps in, leaps in there, gives him the old star fall. Sven! What about Sven? His cunning plan, Jeeves. Feels like that was another cheeky dust from Rubik, right? He didn't catch it. And now PYW gets shot. Fought down by ZC as he comes flying in. The arrow to follow up. Magma on fire. And that was so weird, man. I mean, we are getting a bash right now on Sven. But that was so weird. Just the movement around here. Sven not going with Ori. It's difficult, right? With the Moonlight Shadow and no dust. You need dust. Everyone has to have dust. Whoa, Enigma's got an Ocarine Core? Okay. Oh no, rip your pubs, boys, rip your pubs. It's kind of like a double Midas, right? Well, he's level 18. Sven is level 20, though. Oh, EYW is here. Already on the bottom lane here. They're smoked up. They're on the, they're on the lookout here. What have they got that they can actually counter the Sven with right now? Where is the kite ability? I mean, Storm has silence. And, and silence on top of that. That's a lot of silence. Ben is in there with a the silver edge. The ping comes out. Purple ping. Roshan about to spawn. This is pretty key timing. Pretty key timing to get a kill right now. It's ages, it's cheese. 
Dyer moved away as well. They're looking for a smoke after this ward? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Get some good vision down. Are you serious right now? Are you serious? You could... All right, DY, very fly, very fly. He actually took the outpost from here. Oh, wait, wait, TZY, they're on top of them. They have obs, but no uh, sentry. Dude, how long has the obs ward been there? Very cool. Now the Moonlight Shadow, the counter initiation, and they put the sentry ward down. They see Erica. They have to back this off. They have the black hole. Erica going in there. He's in underneath this. He, I mean, this gives him vision. Limited though it may be. Nice. Ori jumps forward. There's the leap into the egg action as well. Oh, the big black hole against CC beautifully. Life Sealer was inside of that though. Kept him protected for a few seconds. Now the buy box. Everyone's outside the arena though. Sven will get speared. No tree to connect to though. With two buybacks, you wanna you wanna fade this a little bit, right? Your your big CDs are on cooldown. Oh, ZC into the pit. Can they even fight this anymore? Mars is looking. He already used his arena though, so maybe a little bit vulnerable. DY on the low ground. Now the bounty rune's coming through. They've got a little bit of vision of what's happening. They need to they need to take Roche, right? Gaze though. The gaze. Oh, Life Stealer is real low to the left. Oh, that was a beautiful play with the combination of the two supports. It will cost them their Rubik's Life. DY trying to make some space and get himself out of trouble here. Ori, the one getting fire blasted though. The arrow connection super good now as well. Ori stunned forever. Erica comes in though, drops the storm hammer, takes out uh, Ogre Magi. It seems. He's still in the pit. Look how slow Erica is right now. Oh no, the Phoenix! Gets his Glimmer Cape off. Nice! Nice! Wow. Wow. Storms. He gets bashered, boys. He gets bashered and Echo Sabered. And uh, a nice Maledict from Old Eleven to set it up. Maledict? Maleficent. Telephise. <laughs> um, so with the buybacks, they really needed to secure the Roshan here. So Magma and Deep Doo Doo. Penke net worth. Vichy Gaming 22 to 14. I imagine 70 30. Yeah, 85 15. Good auto, though. Oh no, he just wanted to get the outpost back. Old Eleven has literally nothing. He's able to spook Marana out of there. Yo, guys, Halloween should just be from the 5th, from the 6th of November onwards. Until, like, the end of November. Dude, Halloween is October. Oh. Yeah. Alright, Erica with the Basher building an Abyssal. This is his mobility item. We talked about it before. I expected him to get Ags as well, but maybe he can get Ags from Roche. Like, I've been clearing it pretty consistently. 32 minutes into the game, 14k net worth. It's all green at the top of the screen for Vici Gaming on the net worth front. Buyback status could be something we could look at. Yep. Yo, only Mirana and Rubik have buyback. What is this? Norms is on cooldown for four minutes. Boosh. All right, Dyer gonna get set up for defense here. Storm has to be ultra careful. They do have Abyssal on the Life Stealer, so they have counterplay available through the BKB. I imagine he just throws God's strength. Mask of Madness goes on in there. 
Nice, goes in straight away, gets in on top of the Life Stealer. Life Stealer's dreams ended before they could even begin. What a shambles for Magma. Oh my god. He didn't even use his BKB. He did use his BKB. Isn't that something at least TZY goes for the arena back wall play here, but there's a nice mark. That's not that nice. Erica's um Ages is pop. The black hole does find Mars eventually, but Storm Spirit not really contained by it at all. Nice, they'll take Kaz as a plus one. Do you just GG at this point? The creep wave are getting cut though by Storm. He is not interested in giving up this game, that's for sure. He says, nah, I'm good. I'm good. And they have so many dead heroes, they want to capitalize on this, but Storm cutting that wave, doing such a good job of frustrating their efforts. Round two, ding, 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 15 seconds for the Lifestealer, you can take the tower. But can you, with Storm zipping in on top of you? Here we go, we'll find out, zip, zap, zippity, zip, zap, zap. Oh, he actually repair kid? repair kit that? No, Ogre Magi did it somehow. Can you do that from the fountain? That's pretty insane. Let's go. Go a little deeper. Take a few rocks. Chase in. ZC. The Abyssal play though. BKB. He's getting melted before he can do much of anything. Erica covered the whole time by the storm. Gets his BKB off the time to dodge the Zaro. Now I go through to make sure the Life Stealer doesn't survive the black hole. He almost did. I mean, he did, jeez. But then Erica was ready. There's the GG. Game one. BG Gaming. They will secure it. No one's surprised, I think. Yeah, they had answers. The only thing that wasn't really answered was the uh, the storm spirit, right? And look at this. Look at all the lemons. Six, zero, and ten. MVP for me. Black holes. You had a couple of phenomenal ones. A couple that were a little bit hit and miss, but I mean, it paid off. It paid off in the end, I think. Um, Erica again, shining light of uh, position one play in China. Thirteen, one, and eight. Very consistent. Um, and quite, you know, quite deathful as well. Quite, quite the murderous Prosif. You know? But no, I like the, uh, I like the Enigma. Enigma was good sport. Enigma was good sport. You have to tenth pick it though, because otherwise your enemy just takes silence. Um. What's happening with the lobby jeeps? Ten out of ten. Give them Probably the streaming on the eight minutes, guys.
your hero. Five seconds. Now your team ban. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to the AMD Sapphire OGA Dota Pit China. It's Team Magma versus Feature Gaming. I am generally Jeevicus, and yo, this draft is underway. It's it's getting started. They're thinking about buying the IO. The undying Jeeves. Creepy. Undying. Oh, is this Lobby Duff? Oh, no. Lobby broken. I think the lobby's broken, but... Ooh, no, fans. no, okay, okay. They were just thinking. Oh, dire team ban! Revio, no surprise. Um, so I mean, I try to set up for some Omni play here for Vici Gaming, maybe. First pick, Vichy Gaming. Are they gonna first pick Sven? Come on, Dire Team, pick it, nope. pick it good. Band. You plan. Bloodseeker's there. Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Radiant Team pick. Lena. All right, start with the Lena. Amber Tower of Power. Um, oh man, Rick, only what kind of heads off your whole undying. Hero. Maybe you just go for Mars for TZY then. Yeah, Seems very comfortable in the hero. Gaming maybe forced more towards a lifestealer type Whoa. draft anyway. I mean, they've got the Lena, so they could go Morphling. Seconds left. Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. Come on, Radiant Team, you gotta pick them right. Okay, the old con opener. Very nice, very nice. I've not seen Slarder for a while. Old Eleven gonna be pleased to be on that bad boy. See Ori TA as well. This is this is shaping up to be exciting. Well, if Ori has been rather partial to the meme hammer OD recently. 
how do you respond to this? I mean, you go on dying. I mean, you can't really go on dying because Lena. Clockwork. Oh, snap, daddy. I mean, it's, I mean, it's, uh, it's kind of similar. It's kind of similar. It gives you area denial. It gives you this uh, launch capability. Is it going to be a mid snap, though? Or is it going to be a four snap? I think I saw four snap from these guys before. I don't know if we've seen ZC on it. Maybe we have, actually. The two strength hero boys. Undying doesn't feel too bad for Vici Gaming. Radiant team of the earth spirito leaning towards yeah they're leaning towards the morphling leaning towards the tether blade a little bit probably the island of the neil take out the undying they're aware of the danger mars and snapfire not big fans of undying when it comes to the leaning phase Uh, who else is a pin in the neck for the back line? Um, you, you I'll take the hero terrible out. Intra. Oh, morphling. Like morphling is not bothered by tatter blade. You, you, you really got to pick a hero. You got ten seconds left. Um, you, you, you better pick your hero oh, for five seconds. Banned. Let's void. No art cordon. You could go core Slardar and pick up the Beastmaster. Oh man, Rick, there's only ten seconds left to pick a hero. Or four Slardar. Yeah, Lena. Five seconds left now. I mean, Life Stealer's probably the best right now, anyway, right? Radiant team banned. Versus Mars and Snapfire, two strength core, well, two strength heroes. Pretty good with Slardar. He's gonna get the armlet. They'll be able to do Roche fairly early. He's a mid laner that goes well with that, though. Like maybe Disco Stew. Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. I mean, Lifesteal are also good with Magma. I like it with a Snapfire as well, though. If they go like Snap, Lifestealer, uh, not Snap, uh, Clock, Lifestealer. That's a pretty fun combo. Is it broken, though? Is it broken enough to beat Vici Gaming? Probably not. Doc, we're on the clock. The golden time. The golden time ticking away for Team Magma right now. P8. Ooh. That was a hero we did not even contemplate, really. And is excellent with Slardar and Lena. I don't think you're... Hmm. Yeah, Lena with a Laguna Blade is pretty good at finishing P8, actually. Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero. It's a good read. It's a good read. Yeah, Five seconds left now. Yeah, nothing left in life. That's right. What do we want for these guys? Clock. They want the life stealer, but then. Spirit, not Arc Warden. They play Arc Warden? Sniper. You, you really gotta pick a hero. 
So it gives them this minus armor strat. Snap Daddy is ranged anyway. Is that enough for Roche potential? It could be. B. Beastmaster is still available as well, but they have the Mars use. Not like it. Lycan! They don't play Lycan. No, oh, Jeeves, that was uh, Aster. Aster played Lycan. Oracle. Okay. Oracle. Alright, save on save action. That's a lot of physical DPS. That's a huge roach potential with the tag team, the vengeful spirit, the snapfire, the Mars. That's that's very physical related. Omni is great here. He's just dead though, right? Before he gets to cast any abilities, mate. Oh, dire team ban. Hector. It could work, right? The Oracle save on top of Spectre, it's a lot of extra refract black refracted damage. Reflected damage. Um I have burst for days though. As well as rebuke with the vengeful spirit. Better with the stun on top, the Tusk Tag team. That's a dead spec, man. Gotta go first item blade mail. Okay, they get the Viper ban out, they get the OD ban out. Where do they go for mid now? OD's still there, Jeeves. OD still there. I meant the Death Prophet ban anyway. If they get the OD, this is good. This is super good if they get OD. It's an extra save. And they need saves. Um, you, you, you better pick your hero. Five seconds. What happens if they don't get the ODGs? Um, Shadow Demon. They get the OD. Nice, nice, nice. Are they going to take Slark from Magma? Wraith King? <coughs> Excuse me. Storm like Deuce, uh, that's a pretty good pick. I don't know, boys. I like what Magmar's swinging. I like what Magmar's swinging. Yeah, I thought that OD was coming for sure. Coming for sure. All right, then let's break it down for game one, game two, even best of three in the MD uh, Sapphire OGA Dota Pit China for Team Magma TCY Mars ZC Snapfire Mid Kaz on the Vengeful Spirit Chinese Guy in the Tusk and Blank on the Medusa. Over on Vici Gaming, it's Ori Storm Spirit Erica Spectre DY Oracle. Oh no, old Eleven Slider PYW on the Lena. I am General G because uh, let's get our Dota 2 on. Yes, yes. Yeah, I think the Medusa is quite good here. Quite good here. Who do I think is going to win? Who do I think is going to win? Um, I think Magmar. 
Can VG Gaming just outskill them? Look at this Oracle set. Very fabulous. Both 11 plus PYW. That's a pretty murderous situation. Erica, if he goes for Blade Mail early. Ori, what's the catch for Ori? I mean, they've got a lot. They've got Scream. They've got Punch. They've got Guards. They've got Swap. They've got Stun. They've got Ear. Got answers, boys. They've got answers. And Erica Spectre are gonna get blowed up. All right, all right, all right. What does the robot say? Damn, 52 48%, four points. Draft advantage to the Radiant. Mangoes, mangoes, mangoes. Kaz has a mango. So does DY, though. Oh, more mangoes on VG Gaming side. It's over. VG Gaming with the win. All right, let's go. I think they got heroes that can kill the spectre what what about my whole monologue about the wave of terror with the tag team and the mars god's rebuke and snapfire it's cool man it's cool ego got me Whew, 30 seconds until the, 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 loving the oracle set the here very cool, very cool. Lena's hair is actually on fire. Very cool. Did he fix it, boys? Fix it. Yeah, I mean, if a spec goes blade mail, going double wraith band. Mm. Well, there's that pesky horn. Right, TZY is here with the God's Rebuke. He's looking for Bracer. He's looking for Phase Boots. Erica looking for a couple of Wraith Bands. DY, guy, no problemo. P, no one's gonna die. Ah, perfect. Things get a little bit frisky downstairs though. Hold 11, he's pushing it down in, he's pushing it in. Look at this secret wave right under the guns of the tower. Bam, bam, they're dead. Oh, Kaz, can you get the deny? Can't even get close to the deny. He's, he's, he still wants it. He's thirsty, he's deny thirsty. Wave of terror, that's going to push the lane back in favor of old 11, I'm afraid. Old chap. For deny, nice, nice, crush. He actually uh, accelerates the push here a little bit because he knows he doesn't have much too, too many creep to work with. Actually burst down some creep. And under the tower, look for the CS. Oh, there it is. And another one. Oh, he messed that one up, he messed it up. And the courier got killed. Oh, it's a disaster for Vici Gaming. Just called GG right now. ZC getting a little bit handled the mid lane. Gets lucky with the uphill miss though. Mars with a lane of his own. Good man. So a little bit of a pull through here, but old eleven farming it for now. Kaz is on top of the situation. Granny getting chunked a little bit once again in the mid lane, but back up to the high ground. High ground is your savior, sir. Going for double wraith bond still. Okay. Pretty even though I have to say. Ori and Storm. Ori is the Storm Chiefs. Ori and ZC in the mid lane. Pretty even for CS. Mars getting chunked again. Nice dagger play. He's got solve running though. He'll be just fine. I feel like this is the murder lane. You're 
like for the dire. Oh, it's the washing machine, guys. It must be Sunday. Oh, the bats. Alright, alright, alright. Is our first blood coming? I mean, Stone Gaze is your guy at GOV card for when the haunt comes, right? And I imagine we see, like, Blade Mill Defusal super early on. Nice, Tight Striker Ray. Can they get anything out of this, though? Old 11 traverses the lane, but it takes them forever. Dude, those Crimson Pauldrons look badass. Oh, the first blood. We saw it, guys. 100% it kills, 100% of the time. It's Oracle looking for poor Tusky here. He's healing. He's healing. He won't get the kill. Poor Tusky. Gonna be Grand Tusky. Hearing the first blood there. This guy is pretty good. Chinese guy on the position four. Keep an eye on this fella. Be noble players, guys. See if anyone, see if we recognize who is orange. And uh, things starting to even up here in the mid lane, by the way. The runes. Four seconds before they spawn. DY prepped and primed. It's, uh, it's top. It's double damage. He will take it. Already a little bit disappointed, but he still has he still has a ball charge to work with. ZC, no bottle on him anyway. Shotgun Blast goes a little bit wide. He's level 5 on 4 action. Double damage Oracle, where are you? Helped your bro with the, the gank mid there, sir. Holding him in place could have been very uh, effective. Waiting for the gank, huh? No one expects the Inquisition of the Oracle with the double damage and 92 right click damage. It's Savage Fury. Not even going to use it. Badman. No. Hit Strike will connect. PYW getting tickled up on the way out. Cars running a full salve in front of their face. Finally gets it cancelled, but a little bit too late. Now the 5 minute bounty runes. Ori will collect up on that one. Granny making a move over here. She has a bottle now as well. Oh, I think maybe the bottle was handed off. To the bro. Get it filled and then he never got it filled because he never got the eye yet. Yeah, probably what. TZY's bottle is full though. We saw it, 100% of the kills, 100% of the time. Actually, I want to see this. This is a, a rotation that makes this happen. Old 11 is low, so he can't engage right now. So PYW is on the front line. Kaz comes in from the side with the stun, the magic missile. Yes, throw in the wave of terror. And here we go, look, the shards. The connection is perfect. It's, it's actually Tusk and Vengeful Spirit that make it happen. And Medusa just gets to collect on the kill. Very nice play from the supports there. Here's a light striker raid. Right? Oh, PYW headed to that mid lane set up the ZC kill. And uh, he didn't get the ball filled out of it, but he, I mean, it's, maybe he did and he just, he just chugged it all already. Oh no. Water of strategy. Ow. Ow. Run over the top of him? Ow. Alright, Magic Missile. Oh, Task is right there with the tag team. Okay, okay. I thought, yeah, okay. Mayan, Mayan. Yeah, I mean, Chinese Tusks, uh, Chinese Fours are just insane, man. Kaz with a stun, but old 11, he's a chonky boy. He barely feels that, actually. One bracer, and he has 1k HP. Full wand ready to pop off now as well. A lot of damage from the... From the, the arrow, though. Wait, that's a pretty good catch. Level 7, Ori. He will melt the Medusa. Yes, here comes the arena from KZY. Tlard are going to die, unfortunately. DY, he's trying to run his ass out of there. Three of them in on top. Who's TPing in here? It's PYW, Light Striker Ray is going to be pretty golden. Takedown one, takedown two. Ori with a double kill. I mean, that's essentially a triple kill. I don't know. Just the timing is a little bit off. And this is what you want from your Storm. This is what we wanted to see last game from Magma Storm. Look at this guy popping off here. 
instant pressure. Erica's down here now as well. Top tower unmolested. Medusa's gone top to top off lane just to try and hit some creep for now. Things way too frisky for her too early. And Erica, self popping off. Power treads almost finished up here. Everyone heading top. The pressure they think is going to be mostly focused bottom for now. But they're wrong because they're, I mean, they're setting up mid. I mean, Mars is here. They, I mean, they're, they're reading it. They're reading it. Catch sight of this little Lena. They see Ori now as well. Here comes Mars. Like we say, he's got that arena ready to play. They start with the cookie stun. The follow up isn't there though because everyone's hiding in the trees ready to deal with it. Ask is killed off and a great bait mate from Ori. Oh, cars. Alright, I mean, they go in on old 11. The big ult coming in from Snapfire from downtown. The damage is considerable. He's dead. Is he? Is he? Is he? Yep, he got him. Easy Y, keeping eyes on the prize. And uh, Snapfire going to follow him in, going to lead him in there with the ult. Yeah, blade mail after treads for Spectre for sure. He needs this blade mail. He needs Fusel. Yo, Kaz is just dead. Easy Y, has he got an arena? He does. The Kuki forward with the illusion. Not bad. Speed him to the wall here. He's got a little bit of mana to zip though, and he should just get out just fine. No, the shotgun blast. Did he try and turn on that? I don't know. I think PYW was coming in anyway. Old 11 as well. He wanted to turn, but maybe he should have gone out and then in again. This illusion still giving them all this vision. Kuki forward. Oh, target on top of Lina's spear. She dead as well. Damn, double kill for ZC. The Kuki plays, boys. The Kuki plays. When I saw this hero getting in, um, in, uh, introduced, I was so delighted, man. I was like, oh, we can talk about Kuki plays for days. I can't wait to see the $18 million Kuki on Roche, boys. It's coming. It's coming. On the safe lane, Anna. On the safe lane, Anna, Granny. But people don't play safe lane, Granny. Exactly, Jeeves. It's the uh, it's the mid clock where Thompson as well. Yo, Eric, he gets he gets he gets going on. He haunts his ass out of there. He'll be fine for now. Goes to the mid lane where he faces ZC. Not the happiest of prospects, I'm sure, but able to debate it out, no problemo. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Yeah, very well used Fang illusion. It got two kills, right? Two cookie kills. So Medusa building up Manta style, Wraith Bands are done, Spectra building Blade Mail already got the expensive Broadsword. Broadsword is plus 15 damage? What? Value. Alright, trying to tease PYW here a little bit. Look at this. Look at this. Gaben smiling on Magma. Coming in hot with the Arcane Ring actually handing it off though. Giving it to Granny? I think so, I think so. Granny as well. Almost has Ag's scepter done and dusted. This is the less than precise initiation tool that we talked about in the draft, right? They still have the Vengeful Spirit to set things up. Mars with the arena already there and then dropping out on top. Talking of which, Old Eleven gonna get snowballed in with the tag team. He's dead. Yep. Magic Missile. I don't know if he even had any movement opportunity there. I think he was punched before that could connect. So, Medusa at top of the bus for farm. 8 to 7 right now. If you are betting on first to 10 kills 
My commiserations. Impending heart attack. Mm. Blade mail is done for Spectre. First use here on the Ancients. Working, it's working. Storm going in here, trying to catch Task off guard. Pressure consistent though on the tower. Fortification comes through now. They pull the creep wave away. PYW and Ori answering the call. Oracle coming in on the high ground here. Wait, they zip forward on this back line. Mars is the target. Lena annihilated. Does get the Laguna Blade off in time though. Here comes Old Eleven ready to drop some bombs. He's the one that gets punched up though. Murdered almost. Is he dead? No, he's still alive. Barely. Ori not so lucky. Gets swapped back in. The scream. Zip away. Zip, 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 zip away, sir. Safe for a few more seconds. Old Eleven taking another blast. Here comes Erica finally joining the fight. But the Kiki up to the high ground. The crush will not land. Poyo, 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 aka Erica going in with the blade mail. It's kind of working. Ori, he actually gets some pressure down there. Uses what mana he has to secure a double kill. Snowball back in for Task. The purgations coming through. Ori coming back in. Not much mana at work, but they'll still get the kill. DY sealing it. And Vici Gaming, without very many resources to work with at all there, they pick up three kills. Really, really, really well. How did he manage to manage his mana so well there? Super, super smart play from Ori. Like every every zip he did was calculated, right? Um, in such a way that it left him unexposed, but still he did enough damage just to turn those particular team fights. Trading towers now, tier one bottom for tier one mid. One mid is gone already though. An oracle, a little bit out of position, quite a lot out of position actually. Oh, he doesn't know. Looking for the TP, the star, the snowball, he gets out, are you serious right now? What? Stupendous. I mean, it's all about securing bounty runes, sure, sure, Get make sure you get at least 50% of them. Yeah, first 10 kills on Vici Gaming, boys. Blade mail again, this time for the stack of Ancients. Kill those vibrations, boys, I can do, 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 do. Tower down. Okay. I mean, it's kind of evens things up a little bit. Um, it doesn't at all, Jeeves. They're way ahead on tower pressure. Oh, yeah. I never noticed it. Oh, look at this. Junk of blue right now. I mean, it's kind of... This is contested. Super contested because they're smoking up. They are going a hunting here in the jungle. Who can they find? Well... Here's Mars. Where's Granny? I thought she was nearby. She is just there in the lane. They zip forward. They do find Mars. The haunt in on top of him. The light striker raid. The snowball save at the last second though. Pull him away. Old 11. Gonna be the guy that it lands on. And uh, that's two. Oh shit. Mars was already dead, huh? You can get in the snowball? No, he didn't get in the snowball. Alright. Cool. So Medusa, what's the crack with Medusa? Wraith Bands, Mask of Madness, building Skadi, building Butterfly, eh, no, eh, building Manta Staff. On a real kind of time, on a real kind of time limit here, it feels like. Not where you are normally. Spectre, though, this is pretty good. If they get a kill, they will. If you can get the counter kill, ZC goes in, the cookie plate is stun him up, hold him in place, the vortex, no problemo, Ori ready with the swap, uh, ready to get swapped out though, Kaz, he takes him down, Kaz is dead, that is, now the snowball back in on top of Oracle, ZC handled, oh it's worth it for DY, even if he does die here, but he will save himself the last second, light strike away from on high from PYW, the Aether lens, the reach is incredible, now he's got the Laguna, he's used it up, Jeeves, oh shit, okay, well, it's working, Gaming, yes, they lose Erica. Easy Y puts down the GG branch. Light Strike Ray catches him against all the odds. Old 11 coming in now as well. Here comes the zip from Ori. Again, calculated. Just enough damage to seal the kill. Making sure he does not get caught out here. Free Bloodstone as well, so. 
maybe afford to play a little bit riskier. Medusa still top the bus for farm though. Vampire Fangs, look at this. Triple ultimate orbs, that's what she's looking for. She wants to go total recall on them. You see, Ag Scepter, well done and delivered. No problem with that. I mean, this is big. Here we go, gobble, bubble, bubble, firing them in there, snowball back the way, the alt does come out to try and save Spectra, uh, Spectra, Oracle for a few seconds, but hey ho, hey ho, Oracle's dead, could use the gobble, only a 30 second cooldown on that as well, Van braces, hell yeah, you want Van braces. Super good item on Storm Spirit. TZY, he's chilling here. He's got a blink dagger. He was chilling. The anti chill has actually connected. He's very much not chilling now, Jeeves. The spear, wait, the arena, it's a little bit excessive. I don't know. Snowball is here again, but no save. Once more, over 11. Now with the crush down, the clap dock now. Erica, though, looking for Kaz. Looking forward. Looking forward with the blade mail now. He did pop out a little bit of alt damage. I think it was Gobble Jeeves. I definitely was Gobble the Scream though. Old 11. Yikes. Not much you could do about that one. They're still chasing forward though. They know there's no Scream. Or he explodes the task. Now the Laguna Blade, the Light Strike Array. PYW God. Beachy Gaming explode all over them. And Erica. We don't have to worry about slow Erica. Blade Mail plus uh, Yasha. It's 19 minutes into the game. He's looking for Manta. He's at every fight, more or less. 2 1 and 12. 14 of the 22 kills he's been present in right now. Why? Got an Aether Lens. He's got a shovel. It's a passive shovel. There we go. He does use it. Oh, it's a Bounty Rune as well. See? This is why you need to use your shovel, my dude. Farm acceleration, yo, it's, uh, yo, the mana's done. I debate you not. Twenty minutes in, Manta, Blade Mail, Power Treads, two Wraith Bonds, full one, done. Got an Essence Ring now as well. Very groovy item. I mean, they killed Spec, right? But they used everything to kill Spec. Now, the Roche potential is there for both teams. I mean, find like a little Blightstone or something. Uh, Ori now with 19 Bloodstone charges. You know, is that shit cumulative? Fuck. Top of the bus net worth on the Storm Spirit, then the Spectra, then the Medusa. Here goes Old Eleven. He's super far ahead of the smoke gunk. He finds Kaz. The blink crush will actually land on target. Kaz is dead before he can even blink there. Kaz doesn't have blink jeeps. No, I mean like literally physically blink. So they know they're doing this, right? Because the illusion. Yeah, kill the illusion. But they know for sure, right? Yeah, try to get set up on this. Nice! Whoa, the Light Strike Array, the Laguna Blade. Oh, Erica now with a haunt forward. He goes in, he goes out, he shakes it all about. He's trying to go in on top of Medusa. The Scream is there, though. Back off for now. Head back into the pit. Finish your business with Roshan. Old Eleven was doing it the whole time. An age is secure for Ori. The number of Uno. The number of Uno ages carrier on the Storm Spirit. That Shrak is not bad either, boys, by the way. I mean he's got 20 bloodstone charges. He's not gonna be he's not gonna be suffering for mana, right? I mean that would be too bothered. Clarities are super value now, right? They scale late game with your uh, with your mana pool. No? That's the case. All right, we're going Scotty on Medusa. How's the mana style done? Up and dusted. Storm Spirit. All right, he's going Shiva's guard. I 
Yes, there's a lot of armor on Medusa. Um, with the Slardar though, it's a pretty good combo actually. It's it's cool to get like a Dessa on your team. But better because it's AoE G. Well, more expensive. Ori, 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 Ori. Yo, Light Striker Ray Lina, she's down here as well. Wait. Oh, he was looking. He was looking. It's all happening. It's all kicking off up top. By the way, they throw in the task in on top. Now the snowball. Old 11 was jubated. Jubated. You want to see it again? I want to see it again. I want to see the full jubates, mates. Because he thinks he's... He thinks he's... Uh, thinks he's got her here, right? Look at this. Like, yeah, I'm gonna get ZC. Blink, crush, gives him the old slap down, and then blink him from the side from Task into that punch, the snowball save. There's nothing. Oh, he actually gobbled him out, threw him on top, and then the snowball. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, well, I mean, Kaz does get a little magic missile out, but Medusa just walks away. No interest in saving the vengeful spirit. To the arcane rune very powerful very strong now 21 charges on the bloodstone light striker ray where did the net come from did he net himself oh Ori. i mean they get the arena for free basically you can't really complain about that What's the 60 seconds? 65 seconds. Radiant spotted tower is Actually 75 Gs. But yeah, 65 left by the time it's up. Uh, the haunting for ZC won't find a kill here. Maybe they can find the tusk though. The shards won't stop him. Not with the dagger. Heaps on rolling. Now TZY. Or is on a monster kill streak as he kills Kaz elsewhere. They still fight mid. I don't know. Actually trying to cut off your boy TZY. And old 11 arrives, but he's a little bit too late to the party. They can apply pressure, though. They can push in the tower mid. Oh, hello, Evangelusion. Good start. Very nice. Hey, we damage as well, eh? But Eric, I, no real danger here for him. He can just push this tower down. Collect the gold. Alright, Honda Midas off cooldown in four seconds. Take the little creep so you can eat the big creep. Yes, yes, very good. Easy why I mean he's building a lot of mithril hammers. That's what I'm getting from his build order here. A lot of mithril hammers. He wants a death slayer, he wants a BKB. Um, wow. Oh, you baited. Oh, you baited, old 11. Where's your BKB, sir? Run! Run, old 11. Run! Okay, here comes Storm. Maybe you should have went in on the fight. Well, I don't know. Maybe. He just kills him, though, by himself. No problemo. Where did Mars go? Mars just blinks and TPs out. This is BKB so badly on the Slardar. Yo, DY. Oh, I was even there. Radiance bottom tower is under attack. Nine in a row. How does this even happen? Light strike rate to start things off. Dude, the, the range on that is actually disgusting. Honestly. Honestly, the range on that is actually disgusting. Does she have talent? Alright, she does have a talent as well, at least. I mean, we need uh, Scotty for Medusa so she can fight Spectre. That's the big item there for Magma. A 21k net worth lead, though. The game is going later and later, so things like that might be, might actually be relevant. 
Feels kind of like Vichy getting very much in control, but as I say that, nice pick on the Storm Spirit. Somehow he's still alive, doesn't get his shot as, as Shiva's guard off in time. Old 11 trying to run down Medusa here. Laguna Blade has been thrown, that's a dead task at least. They take two as Grani gets handled as well. The back line by the Spectre. Spectre still looking for more and I look for Medusa. The scream has been used, gonna catch him right on top. Nice spear back by TZY, but old 11 in now with the blink crush on two. Give him the bash down, the crash down. Light striker raise there on top as well. DY! He'll make it happen. They're all dead, Jeeves. They all have buybacks. But damn, I mean, they lost the Storm Spirit, sure. They lost the Storm Spirit. I only got buyback here. I mean, I think you buy back when everyone's up, right? So my back on Mars Medusa. Fortification to hold the tower until then. What's the Roche situation? It's still a minute or two, right? A minute potentially longer. Yeah, I feel you need to get something more here though. I don't think they're gonna get it though. Are they gonna back off from this? Tusk is coming to defend. Vengeful spirit as well. Bit of a mean prospect. He needs more though. He doesn't need everyone though. Storm is not there. He has a butterfly for God's sake, Chiefs. Tusk needs help. Now they go Roche. Like there's no point in baiting this any longer. Your Storm Spirit, he wants to get the bounty runes first at 30 minutes though. And I think you control this area until 30 minutes. Alright. They are indeed all dead, lads. And, yo, look at this. They, 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 are, they are aware that Roche could be up soon, and it's a super early Roche bomb, by the way. They're smoking. PYW, he's a little bit caught out here. He actually blinks away. Worried about the TP getting cancelled. Erica's already moving. They're actually moving in the back lines. And this has worked out really well for VG Gaming. They're not gonna they're gonna miss out on the bounty runes. These guys actually miss out on the Roche spawn by five seconds though. Hold eleven, the smoke will break. He goes for the blink crash. Nice. Look at this. He smashes TZY like he's not even there. Kaz goes for the small bite, but look at this. The back lines, they're already dead. Already all dead. Okay, well, Tusky's gonna buy back Mars now as well. The stream's doing some work, but the BKB keeping old 11 nice and fresh. BKB is up on Medusa though, so she's not taking too much damage. The snowball, the back line, TZY does find the Oracle. The save out already up on old 11 though. He can still throw out some stands. And Medusa's dead for 80 seconds. And this is high ground. PYW with another snatch and grab. Kaz with a save for a few seconds more, but TZY died. It's a double kill. It's a GG. It's a full team wide. you Gaming, very quick 2-0 there. Magma, they have potential, right? They are this wild card. It seems like stuff is working for them sometimes and other times not so much. Like, I don't think you can sleep on this team, but at the same time, I don't think they're a serious contender for top 5 in China right now. Uh, MVP for me, I mean, I gotta give it to Spectre, I think. Like, I mean, Spectre and Ori, um, Erica and Ori, they were both dead considerably, right? Um, during big team fights. But either one of them alive just means a, a pretty much a full team might for Team Magma. They sort of alternated that crown there. But Spectre, I think it's difficult, especially to play this hero, especially versus the heroes. They actually, you know, they picked to kill Spectre. And uh, the 8-1 on 24 tells the story of its own good early blade mail pickup there. Interesting item choice. It's super physical and he actually gets away with the butterfly. Magma tries to go for... Uh, Blank tries to go for the Skadi. Um, but in the end he just can't land the, the hits. And Ori, he's super snowballed by the way. The Orchid into the Bloodstone into the Shiva's Guard. 
very nice game from both of those guys. And you know, you can't do it without your supports. Absolutely. DY setup kills old 11. Blink crushing superstar. And PYW was a god. He was an actual god. So uh, the whole team playing particularly well. 1 11 11. Um, what's next, guys? Survival series approaching already. It's only 10 a.m. Short day for Jeeves. All right, all right. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Do, do, do. Yes, pro season. Elephant versus Team Aster. I don't think we're doing this tomorrow. I think we're doing CDF this tomorrow. Um, let me update. Elephant versus Aster.
idiot team pan. Oh, dire team pan. Woo, radiant team pan. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, let's go for the MD Savar OGA Dota Pagina. Finally, an exciting battle. Elephant versus Team Aster. I am General Jeevicus. This draft is underway. Still playing with Freeze, it looks like, over on Aster. So, I am dying. Goodbye. Goodbye. Tired team band. Yeah, Baden, the Lena, all gonna get kicked to the curb. Does leave the Martian. On, team. Pick him, pick him and the Rubik. Chen. Oh, Chen's fan. It's a little bit early, but they could. They could chance fan over on Aster. Oh damn this bell, dude. Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero. Like honestly, it's 2020. Just send a text alert. You'll get more people coming to church. Honestly, I swear to God, just send a text alert. Everyone who's um a member of the church will get a little text. Church time. Right, we go Storm Marana. That was a little bit unexpected. Chen Sven still an option. Storm is pretty good though. Storm is pretty good. A little bit spooky to get it this early. Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Yeah, five seconds left now. Very little milk left, guys. If this goes beyond a best of two, what we're gonna do? Use either. I need to stock up. Oh, dire team ban. I steal. I mean, life stealer's pretty sweet, right? With the storm spirit, get inside him, fly across the map, take out. I don't feel. Will we see a morphling? Oh, dire team ban. Okay, the blood seeker. By death, prophet. Radiant team ban. Now, Aster, another one of these wild cards where their performance has been 50 50, I want to say, but it's mostly down to who's been playing their mid. So at the moment, they've got Freeze in. Um. Be on the storm spirit, I imagine. Prioritization of that hero for him. Take out the tag teaming Tuscarunu. More focus on mid. Get rid of Lashrak. Sven's still there. Radiant team pick. They'll get the Rubik. Nice counter to the Mirana. The Phoenix is still there, by the way. You, you, you really gotta pick a hero. You got ten seconds left. Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. It's not really a, a counter as such. It's like, um... You can grab the Moonlight Shadow, etc. The arrow's pretty good. Storm's a pretty good foil to the Mars. One here, though. Go for the Phoenix. Something else.
It looks like it's uh it's ominous this draft there. A little different flavor for a change. Uh, the Warlock, we can for Spectre. Um, you, you, you better pick your hero. Five seconds. But obviously, they get to see if it's going to be Ben first, right? Because otherwise, you might think about going Troll Warlord. You can go back for their off lane, but then you're picking off lane blind, which is going to give an advantage to the safe lane paparazzi. Morphling, still a thought, I think, as well. What's the sauce with the Morphling, though? Well, we've seen maybe mid a few times on Mirana, right? Night Stalker. Early pressure to go with the Storm Spirit and Chen. Rubik is flexible as well. They go for the Sven. Okay. Okay. I'm on a terror blade, right? Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. The red panda's still there. Five seconds Not drafted. Oh, dire team ban. Right, they ban the terror blade. So what does that leave? The dry ranger. Dry versus Sven, though, Jeep. Oh, uh, uh, it's not bad. Not good either. You, you really gotta pick a hero. You got ten Life left. stealer, life stealer's bond. Uh, uh, Ain't nothing to accelerate her farm, though. Team take out the TA. Take out the dry. Yeah, dry is the scariest one for them. Entire team ban. Nick's the Queen of Pain. Now this final pick here, is this... Is this for mid? See this Storm Spirit the whole day, the whole game. No, it's there. You really gotta pick a hero. You got 10 seconds left. What's left that can really mess with them though? They banned literally right, every mid hero. It'll be fine. I still have Zeus, I guess. Oh, you're right, it's Clinks. It's Clinks for Oster. You're right, it will be Clinks. Yeah, 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 yeah. Troll, they go troll. Hey, it's the other option. It's normally banned, right? It's normally banned. Might as well give it a go. With the invoker as well. I don't know though. I don't know. Maybe Clinks is better. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, let's go. Game one for Elephant. By the way, it's Yang Gang on the Mars FY Marana. Red Panda on the Warlock, Paparazzi on the Sven, and maybe on the Invoca. Oh, Team Asta! It's Monetra Warlord, XXS Night Stalker, Baboka Rubik. Um, oh, Freeze on the Storm Spirit, and Lan M on the Gen. I am General Jeevicus. Let's get our Dota 2 on! Yeah, Troll's fine. Troll's fine. Oh, it's fine. What are you talking about? I mean, I'm a bit concerned about the Red Panda um, rock. Right? Arrow might be a bit of a pain in the ass. But you can definitely toe for toe with Sven.
I guess, oh look, Kate. What, Kate, Ace Wall? I ain't how this is gonna go down. XXS is gonna swoop in on top of them. Mess people's up. What's gonna happen here? <laughs> Alright, cheers to the pause boys while we get into it. Damn, damn, damn. Eight points draft advantage to Elephant right now. Eight points draft advantage. They don't believe. That's without buying any items just because they have all the mangoes. Red Panda. One mango. Mango supremacy already secured for Elephant. Can't escape your sins. Catch us if you can. Little pause. Little tea. Three hundred. Wrong server. Now they will suffer. Excellent idea. Like Nothing. stealing candy <laughs> from a bed. <laughs> Can't escape your sins. You blew it. All right, well, we're paused. This is cool. Look, look and see what's rocking, what's socking. Oh, very nice. Golden claws, very nice, very nice. Rubik with a golden staff, very nice, very nice. Harambe, resurrected for Chan's mount. Chan looking very Native American here. Bill Warlord, very nice helmet. Look at Very impressive. Sven, that's yeah, quite a basic bitch, Sven, I have to say. It does have a very good sword, though. Sword is quite cool. Inscribed Shattered Great Sword with 1.5k kills, 251 victories, 2.8 million gold earned. 44 godlike streaks. And it has the free to fear kinetic gem. It is an honor to fight beside you. Oops. Very nice. Very nice. Oops. Joker. Playing kid and Joker. No items. <laughs> Some kind of crazy Viking set. Let's. On legacy legs and arm with the crimson progenitor's bane. Oh no. Large. I can't see. Oh, 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 oh. Oops. Pumpkin head. Oops. Well, you tried. You did, you did try. The uh, expensive bunny mount, of course. Very expensive bunny mount. Gift. <laughs> Gift. Gift. I mean, he's rocking some immortals here, right? Mortal head, mortal hand. Oops. Oops. Ow! Oops. 
did we talk about Storm Spirit's outfit though? I don't think we did. Where is he? Here, Luke. Oh, we're back into it. Finally, the delay is over. Let's run on in there. Oh, sinuous. Very sinuous. Let's go, Storm Spirit. Reap your harvest and protect your soul. Oops. Reap your what about Kid and Joker? Oh, Kid and Joker, he's running into the battle here. Yes, running forward, running back. Forgot his courier. Yeah, there we go. Go. Oh, a little bit, a little bit of treemanship here. Running through the forest, running through the forest. Here we go. Or down. It's down a sneaky ward. Matched on the same side. By the storm spirit. Papa downstairs on the fan. Oh, I'm gonna move the text. Oh no! Morty, don't look now, but battle's about to start. Oh my God! No, I ain't ready for this. I, ain't, I didn't do this. Well, you know, the game hadn't started. There was no need to close bets. Bye. The text, Jeeves, that I know, but I know, guys. Catch us if you can. Oops. Oops. Get game started. Get started. Started. All right, the storm hammer to get things going. Uros, a little bit of right hammer, a right, a little bit of right click. So you skill storm hammer, then you save your two skill points. In case you get particularly dived. I don't know if you want to ever put two in war cry. Like, why save the skill points? I mean, maybe it's for the stun, right? Maybe if you think you can get the kill. But they don't want to push the lane early, right? So up until level three, you hold your skill points in Greater Cleat. I hope that happens, otherwise I'm going to look real dumb. Uh, the God's Rebuke. In this lane, do they want to do that in this lane, Jeeves? Night Stalker is pretty puny early on. I don't know how I feel about that combo either. I mean, Rolls getting hammered top though. FY on the Murana, I feel like the pumpkin head has kind of stabilized over the top of her. Maybe we caught her mid leap or some such. Oh, first chief, so it wasn't that. Hmm. Going up and down hills wasn't coded for a small indie game. Alright, drinking the tea, no one die, I'm watching you. Uh -uh. Night Stalker. Troll. Oh, everyone's getting low. Let's see her be having a field day in this game. So, I mean, this is pretty bad for XXS, right? Yes, the Stormhammer now, the multiple chains, the fatal bonds. Red Panda, he's going to CS you to death, sir. Okay, give him the CS now. One, two, okay. How are you feeling there, sir? I mean, he's fine. He's fine. He's, he's tangoing up. Emergency over. Troll's time to suffer. I mean, Freeze has been really quite good on the Storm Spirit and uh, on these mid tempo heroes in general. I think it was him that played the Lycan, right? Very good uh, game style for him. Right, Somnus in the mid lane though, 12 and 2 versus 7 and 0, having no problems handling this freeze at Storm Spirit, just as you talk about how awesome he is. What's he gets level 4, right? Cheeky tornado play though, no EMP to chase it down, but... It's the implication scary enough, and this bomb lane... Paparazzi, completely uncontested here. He's got no fear whatsoever. What about when he gets nighttime? Well, man, then there's just a marginal amount of fear, I think. Radiant's courier got killed. You know how much stuff he was carrying? Ah, uh, as courier was killed. Again, with a little bit of an army here. It's mostly rippers, I have to say. A little bit of right click. Sure, the arrow goes wide, doesn't connect on anything. Yang Gang in a bit of a pickle now. I mean, he won't be first blood though. That'll go to Viboka, of all people. What? 
Radiance Courier has been killed. Wait, he gets CS to death? Alright, cool. Cool. I think he had the uh, the shadow word on him as well. Like, all right. So, bit of rotation here. So, I'm just trying to go ham. Oka is here. Ready to come in? Try and get a lift off. Oh, the regen really not like this. Does he have a bottle? He doesn't, but it's Invoker. So, who cares? Goes in Viz up to the high ground, but they hit him up with the sentry, trying to cancel this off. We'll cancel it, Jeeves. The damage flowing through. A little bit of purge action as well. Feels bad, man. Oh, I bet he wishes he had a ball now. Oh. The chance is relocating back in from the fountain. That's a pretty sweet move, man. Yeah, I think that's exactly what happened. Oh my god, his mana's really almost instantly gone though. FY, leaping in, give him the right clicks. One, two, the arrow's missed, but nice. One more. Oh, felt like uphill miss to me. Didn't show his miss, but it felt like uphill miss. Oh no, and Yangang's dead up top. Monet starting to up the pressure, by the way. How did the bounties go? I mean, it's like 50-50 so far. Oh, I'm gonna score one. I don't want to be collected, right? Yeah, I mean the invoker doesn't really care. Alright, Monet with a couple of Wraith Bonds, the brown booties. Wait. No fear. Uh, Yang Gang? I mean, one net and I'm die. One net and I'm die. One net, no net. Arrow comes through, kills off on a chance creeps. It's a good little, uh, it's a good little body shield, a little meat shield. I mean, you're feeding Mirana gold, but at the same time, your troll is not getting stunned. But I mean, Sven, he's top of the bus right now. Papa is farming. He is farming, boys. Yeah, I think... Um, I don't know what you do as Enigma, actually. Miracle would be good, but... It's not that Wii's bad, it's just his hero pool is limited, which means their drafts are truncated or pushed in one particular direction. Yeah, Wii's been second place in TI twice. Feels bad, man. No, Boboka. I actually saw him round there and I was like, he's fine. Look at this. Somnus comes right across the river, hits him with the EMP pulse tornado combo and then murder. Great. I see he's looking at the Wii as inconsistent chat, boys. Alright, anyway. Jeeves is inconsistent. Where's the ball? It's game six, guys. What's he gonna do? Uh, Yangang? The dead young strike. Look, he's got the shield. Nice. He holds him in place. Now the fatal bond. Somnus is ready to drop some damage. And Monet running his little legs away. No chance to CS him to death this time, though. Oh, death by CS. Like death by a thousand cuts. Did literally nothing to him. Wouldn't be cool if um, it just did like 20 damage, just base damage at least. Fatal bonds, guys. Cool. Suddenly, Warlock Akari. Oh, 
Let's just put plenty of mana up here. So double damage for the tornado. Remember, it's a purge. Okay, nice zip to the side. Somnus, you'll bail. The CS though. That's mine. Mine. Tiny kid invoker. So it is first night. Uh, no surprise. Sven is off jungling up. I guess he's got his mask of madness. Yeah, paparazzi very consistent with his timings here. Mask of Madness, Bracer, no problemo. Building Echo Saber. Oh, nice stack as well. Thank you very much. Good kind, sir. And again, things Mirana gets instant payoff there as well, right? The coins. The Cis Gold already delivered. XXS. He has a minute of darkness left. Making a rotation towards the mid lane just now. Is he looking for Sven or is he looking for. Voker. He realizes he only has like a minute left. I mean, it's been a beeline from Voker the whole time. Here we go. The storm, he goes in, hits him up, and our XXS arriving just at the right moment. Turns it in, kills him up. No problemo. Just at the end of his 10 minutes as well. I mean, it's a little bit unfortunate have this ward here it does not see because the trees haven't been cut down it only sees this side of the 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 cliff oh wait fy darkness is about to end go for the bounty rune if you can get it well played arrow nah gets out of this middle towers under attack Alright, Yang Gang. Got a Roche Pit here with an Aegis. Part of a brown booties. Papa. Look at it. Ancients cleared. Time for some big, thick creep camps. Even need to God Strength for it. Echo Saber all but done. Are they relocating Brosives right now? FY! FY! Is he gonna die? I don't think so. He's still alive. Nice! Oh! The Chibids! Wait, the rock gets dropped on the backside here as he come. I'm looking for XXS. By the way, there is a tornado happening. Mon he's all messed up. Oh, where are you going, sir? Where are you going? No escape. The arena says no. An elephant. Turn it on a penny. They know exactly where he is from these fatal bonds as well. Oh, FY God, man. Remind me, end of the game. FY God, you said it, Jeeves. You said it. Right, here comes Mirana, the Storm Spirit, the Arena. Papa, he popped off his God Strength for this. The arrow going to go through and connect on nothing because of the Tornado, but it's still more than enough damage. Uros is still alive. He's ranking, he's chunking. Can't find it now. XXS looking to close down FY. FY leaps away but gets voided on the way out. Somnus, can he finish Baboka? No. Wait, there was a stolen arena. Wow. Baboka stolen arena, boys. If you idiot, of course it was. I was like, Mars Arena? I'm not sure if his team were like. Fully switched on to the fact because it felt like they were like, uh, wait. Oh, Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. It was just you, Jeeves. You're the only idiot. Couldn't do much about Radiant's bottom tower, could you? Uh, Paparazzi scouts out regen rune here. We'll pick it up for now. Red Panda pushing tower. Okay. Thomas and Yang up top. I mean. XXS, he doesn't have Dark Ascension, so they can catch him with Arena here. Uh, Mars, he's got he's headed back mid. That's unfortunate. Dyer's middle tower's under attack. Uh Storm goes in on that back line, catching up on Somnus. There's the arena from Mars this time round. Baboka, he's ready to steal an arena of his own. He actually has it, Jeeves. It's his arena that was down in the first place. Oh my god. Arena on arena action. XXS. He gets trumpled up. Who's in there? Who's dead? Invoker's dead? 
Where's Mars? Mars is running on the Moonlight Shadow. They're only saving Grace, it seems. Mars dead. Is he? Mars dead. Mars dead. Again, Bavoka with the arena. I was like, yes, Mars has got the arena. Look at this. Look at this. First arena goes down. But I'm thinking it's Yang Gang with a save, right? But it's not. Look, and Joker's here. He comes running along right underneath the dire vision, by the way. Zip zap. Here we go. Storm pulls him in. The focus the one that throws the arena down. And then they're kind of just left there. He's trying to run out of it. I don't know. He just gets killed in amongst them. But yeah, good play, good play, good play. So, 5 to 6 right now, 3k net worth to Elephant, Baboka playing out of his socks, Somnus getting picked a few times too many, but Storm Spirit still bottom of the bus, you know, 4.4k uh, 4 .4 K net worth. Being chased by Marana, mate. Papa, going a little bit hard here, he's got BKB, I don't think so. Alright, he's got a Storm Hammer, he's, he's wrecked though. Wait, the rock, the rock. Keep running, Papa. Keep running. XXS trying to get in there. Somnus covering that back line. Don't really have a good angle of entry. I mean, Storm had mana. Mana for plays. Mana for days. You have this vision here. Can't see that ward. Are you serious? They can see it. Maybe it's the old Jebate play though, right? You know that they have vision, but they know don't know that you know that they, that you know they have vision. Oh, Lan M, no mana to play with here, but his big squad on the back lines do gonna get fed up to paparazzi Sven though. Dropping in there, mask of madness going harm. Night stalker super low, by the way. Having a little fight, Arini with Mars. And Mirana. 10k net worth on the Sven. KB is coming. It is coming. Storm Spirit, he's looking for the Bloodstone. Monet, he's got a Sanj and Yash. That's his play into. I guess it's BKB, right? Why already with the mech? Hurt those brown boots and arcane boots. We get a Yule Scepter first. Dominus looking for a vessel. Oh, the arrow. Oh, Baboka. He, he dodged it. And then he nearly caught it. And he dodged it again. Just imagine you could catch Mirana arrow. Throw it back. Yang Gang. Ooh. EMP. Can it help him out? It will get that kill on the Rubik's back line though. Somnus getting melted but here comes Paparazzi ready for the Storm Hammer. Oh, a little bit of confusion caused by the Hand of God. Chen Gang making it happen. Moonlight Shadow, they're trying to chase forward. Yang Gang looking for Lan M. He could find the spear angle, can't find it. He's getting chased up to the high ground. Now the Storm Hammer through from Uros as he tried for troll, but they are. Arrow again misses for Mirana. They have to fall back and it's all gone kind of pear shaped because XXS has popped off the darkness. The dark ascension giving them all this vision and information. Somehow though they're all still alive and Invoker's about to respawn. I mean Moni is stood right here. Okay the arrow again. Gang gang. Not helping. I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> Oh man, Mars plus Mirana, what a combo. Wait, Storm, he's coming in, he wants a piece of this action, they're looking for FY, the arena's good this time though. Nice, Sun Strike, the Storm Hammer, the Dead Storm, the Storm is slipping away from them. Not a dead storm, Jeeves. He's not. They do trade FY for the Night Stalker. Yo, Yang Gang. That was a little bit harm. Eww. Eww. 
Oops. Alright, hate stream for pop-up. Michael Sabres goes BKB. 10 seconds, yet to be revealed. A red panda. Doing four stuff, right? Lana, I'm rebuilding the army. Oh, I mean, this is a good one. The golem is, is tasty. Come on, golem. You gonna come back for golem? Really doesn't want golem? Alright. I mean, it gives you, um... Magic resistance, right? Or is that the purple seer? Alright, we got the vampire fangs. We got the vampire fangs, chief. Up on troll warlord. We're all out of tea. We're gonna let him sip next. Like shadow for cheap initiation. Let's see if they can find some. Oh my god, this is pretty clutch if they get it. Actually, oh, there's the spear, the storm hammer forward, Rubik pimp, pummeled, deaded. Nice though. End from the side with freeze, and then on top XXS. That's a lot of damage being shit down on top of them. Mars Arena does come through, but he still falls. Fan daddy. Oh no, the storm hammer on three. The cleave. The cleaving thing, oh my god, Monet, he's running. Now they look for Storm on the low ground. He's, he's dead. That's a four times kill streak for Somnus. The cleaving thing, elephant opening up on them there. Papa holding the Storm Hammer for the perfect situation. And he even gets some ancients off of his god strength. Feels value, man. Here. I mean, I'm surprised he's still there. I'm surprised where Troll's position is right now as well. He's got the Sans and Yash rock rocking on here, the BKB. But Papa, a full one eye in my head, I would say. Easily a full one eye in my head. Yeah, he's got an acceptor now as well. Like, um, not only was a full eye in my head, but he was. Um, these two items are cheap, right? Mask of Madness and Echo Saber. Cheap. So, Sanjin Yash is a little bit pricey. Three items ahead. BKB's coming. Pray for BKB, boys. Give him the, they give him the old bufferini for the old Sven here. Push the tower. Talked about this in the draft, right? We should have done at least. Joker plus Sven. Combo. Do you have Roche? I think they want to take the fight first though, right? Well, the Moonlight Shadow's been used early as a sort of aggressive defensive pushing tactic. So roughly where people are going for the rose pit right now is a little bit dangerous storm up on the map Boca XXS on the low ground they have vision of this they know this is happening I mean you see everyone else as well it's pretty scary Mars though he is smoked up and less uh, less obvious I thought storm had TP but he's actually just still sitting in lane here Joker Illusion, gonna give him a little spook. Force him back though. Oh, the Mars Arena, this is a pretty good catch on Monet. Where's the BKB, sir? BKB not complete. Yang Gang now taking the full fury of the trolls. He starts to go hard bones with the ultimate, pulling him away. Somnus ready, shockwave back. The hand of God, that's a dead troll. Paparazzi's got the BKB up. He's ready to go charging forward. Look for XXS, he popped the dark ascension. Now they dropped the golem on top of him. Um, I mean, Sven's here. He's got double damage. I mean, from the God Strength, at least he's pumping into the tower. 
Trying to bring it down. There's the alacrity on top as well. Very good, very good. Lots of damage, lots of damage. Buildings falling. Fire base is burning. I mean, I mean, what more can they do here though? It's like, that's pretty much it. Go back, take Roshan maybe. Oh wow, that range racks took so long to go down without the, the, the god trap. So they're pushing towers out again. They want to take Roshan. Dangerous to TP when this fan has axe, but okay. I don't know if they do want to take Roshan. Maybe they want to get some quick kills here. Mon H trying to come out and get some ancients desperately looking for some farm. Get something at least. Nah, it's particularly good here versus the Troll the Night Stalker, right? And this, this Storm Spirit as well. The Axel's fan. I like the Echo Saber build as well. It makes man fight control a lot easier. Night Stalker as well, because Night Fang. Ah, a pause. Can't they really contest this right now? Um. I mean, they have Storm. Storm can always zip in and out. Oh, a little bit of a scan coming out here. They know they're coming. They're coming. The Moonlight Shadow, FY. He'll cloak them up. Get ready to try and pull out of this. It's too late, though. They're already committed fully. The double damage is up now as well on Sven. Got the God Strength available. Yo, they're going. EMP on the back line doesn't catch anyone, though. Sven throws out the war cry. He's hunting forward right now. De warding, de creeping. Can't really get anything out of this mid lane though. Need to go bottom. At least top can, could be an option. Top feels way more dangerous though. They haven't secured that outpost yet. Multiple points of egress from the keys. I think it's still quicker to TP the second time here, right? Then the third one here. Somnus, he has the spirit vessel finished up. FY, he's got Yules. He's got Mechanism, Arcane Booties, Sven. He just, he's like, fight me. They say, no, thank you. You can have that outpost. We don't really like it anyway. Your one is better. Oh, they can't take their ones. Used. Oh, no. Oh, no. What have they done? The trade. Oh, no. Oh, no. What have you done, Jesus? Why is he there? Wait, Storm is there as well? Okay, they. they they were gonna fight him and uh just chilling you know he's walking on by 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 oh god oh oh god oh god oh god oh god oh god pretty much yeah there's a fight oh storm died we need to get that we need to get that right, let's go i mean it's a super fast kill we we're literally missing nothing Okay, the leap forward into the Yules. Yes, nice fan with the storm hammer. Bam, he's dead. Looking for Monet now up on the high ground. What did he steal? What did Boboka steal? Nobody knows, Jeeves. Nobody knows what Boboka stole. Storm hammer. Fight this. We got time to go top and see that tower go down. Okay. We do. Alright, we got the Blink Dagger up in Viz Rune, backpacked or in the, the bottle at least for now. Salt Kuras, do they need this for the push? Not really. Still have a good two and a half minutes on this Aegis. FY playing a little bit dangerously here. The smoke from Aster. Yang Gang on the high ground. Smoke will break. Yang goes in, throws down the arena of his life. The BKB's coming through. Mirana, I think, already dead, though. Not much you can do about that. Yang Gang pops off his BKB. All BKB's expended for now. Rubik is dead, by the way. Lan M gonna follow up. Here comes Paparazzi. He's got an Aegis, by the way. Storm Spirit, he wants a piece of this. He tries to get in on the action. The Moonlight Shadow, another Storm Hammer. Storm is dead. Are you serious right now? Sven takes him down. The Aegis is popped. He's ready to get back up. He's got his BKB ready to roll as well and he is ready to beat some ass oh yes xxs died monet 
He's doing the ultimate, it doesn't matter. There's the GG elephant, triumphant. Remember, it's big elephant now, boys. Little elephant was put to bed. Who was your MVP, Jeeves? Uh, FY? It's definitely a. I mean, Somnus was real good as well, I have to say, actually. Pretty good in Joker, please. What about all the missed arrows, jeez? Well, it was mostly Mars' fault. Yeah. Yep. European 12, MVP for me. Very nice, very nice. All right, guys, that was game one. We've got game two coming up very shortly. Let me check the lobby here. Yes, eight out of 10. So we'll give them a few minutes to get ready. One. And what does the clock say, G? What does the clock say? I think this will be rather I'm gonna make a cup of tea, probably the last cup of tea we can make today. And uh, due an unforeseen accident, we also. Yeah, bad time.
five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. Woo, Radiant Team Band. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to the MD Sapphire OGA Dota Pit China. It's Elephant versus Team Aster. I am General Jeevicus. The draft is underway. Goodbye, Mars. Goodbye, Io. Goodbye, Undying. Goodbye, Lena. Entire team band. Oh, it's Lena. Do you ban the Rubik? This first pick. First pick for Elephant. Come on, Radiant Team, you gotta pick him up. Got the Undying. So Rubik is still there. And still there. Is there anything they value more than the chat? Yeah, 79, that sucks, man. Dota Pit's been underrepresented by gambling, though, I think. Especially the Chinese one. I don't know why. Like, day one, we had like 400 viewers or something, and then day two, like 80, and then today it's like 45. I don't know what's up. Be the delay. Go, dire team, pick them up. Pick Little magi. Radiant team, Chen. Chen. So, do they go back for Sven, or are they gonna face Sven Chen? <laughs> they just rotate drafters. Okay, so they will face the Sven Chen then. I mean, they want to go for a dry revenge lineup on top of this. They get through the bonds though. You, you really got to pick a hero. You got ten seconds left. Yeah, it was a little bit weird saw this drafting, but I liked it. This draft was a winner. Milk. Radiant team band. Rubik. They were driving. A Rubik. Yeah, the door up it. Viewership has gone down as well, Tinky Cat. I noticed. I noticed. I think Twitch has uh, done something a bit weird. I don't know. They take out Lashrak. They take out uh, Dry Ranger. I don't think people watching on VPN are. Uh... being counted or something. I don't know. Oh, Dire Team Ban! Bloodseeker! And the Morphling Ban! Yeah, I thought they were looking at Drow, and then if you don't get Drow, Morphling is the next kind of... Next hero, right? Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Yeah, five seconds left now. Oh, Dice Viper. Monkey King. Alright, we bring in the Magnus. You, you, you really gotta pick a hero. You got ten seconds left. PA Inspector are options here. PA is a little uh, you, slow. You Sven is still on the table as well. 
Kind of like a dare you type pick though, right? I mean, say you pick the PA for elephant. That's mid. Brewmaster. This is sort of a file for PA, right? Come on, radiant team, you gotta pick him right. Juggernaut. Yeah, that'll that'll do though. That'll do. Life stealer. Nah, they go for the span. Radiant team ban. Yeah, no, that's fine. Is it Panda Brewmaster though, or Yang Brewmaster? Yeah, five seconds left now. We'll see. We'll see. I actually like uh, Panda Brewmaster. It's real good. Entire team ban. Take out the Beastmaster. Take out the Omni Knight. Oh, they think Magnus is mid. Radiant All right. Team ban. Oh, and then Mirana mid, yeah, I mean, we still missed it. Uh, ten seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Um, you, you, you better pick you your hero need in five seconds. Oh, the need for Sven. Oh, buff. Joker, he gets banned out in the mid lane. That was the last kind of buff available, Radiant right? Uh, uh, they could try the Lycan. And then Magnus though, and Chen as well. Doesn't you, you really gotta pick a hero. You got ten seconds. Uh Slardar. Five seconds. Oh, Slardar. The Storm Spirit. And the Brewmaster's redundant. No. Put Red Panda. You could put Yang on the Mirana. Uh ten seconds to pick your hero, you uh, Magnus mid versus the Storm Spirit, uh, though. You, you, you better pick your hero. Five seconds. I think they go back for Void. Yeah, they go back for Void Spirit, I think. Um, it deals with Storm Spirit fairly well. It's accelerated by the Magnus, and... It means Magnus is a little bit easier, because he wants to rotate anyway, right? Or at least Juggernaut wants to be in the same lane as Magnus, around about seven and a half minutes onwards. So he can get to Magnus, he can get empowered, he can farm up all of the enemy jungle while Magnus goes bottom for the defense. Uh, or top for the defense, as it may be in this case. Omnis is on elephant. Oh. oh, Sean is on one. Uh, Dazeel! Dazeel. Does your mid? What? Okay, let's go. Game two, best of three. AMD Safar, OGA, Dota Pit, China. Elephant versus Aster for Elephant. It's Panda on the Ogre Magi, which of course means it's uh, Yang Gang on the Brewmaster, Panda, uh, Paparazzi on the Sven, Som the Storm Spirit, FY Marana, worst introduction of all time, Jeeves. Indeed, for Team Aster. Freeze on the mid Dazzle. Money on the Juggernaut XXS, a uh, Magnus, Baboka on the Rubik, and Lan M Chen. I am General Jeevicus. Let's get our Dota 2 on. Remember, follow me at twitch.tv slash Jeeves Dota TV.
Oops. Oops. What does the robot say? Four points draft advantage to Elephant again. Coming in here. Mangoes, indeed, they have the mango advantage. All the mangoes are belong to us. Let's go, mango. Yeehaw, yeehoo, indeed. XXS, he's down here. He's building bracer, he's building brown booters. Fine, fine. FY once again, pumpkin head in place. And gang. The Aghanim's flail. Aghanim's flail. Our high spirits coming through right now from Team Elephant. I'm gonna face check Lan M here. Lan M with a headdress. Oh, the high five bait. The high five bait. You gotta give it to him, young guy. Oh no. No. He tried to get the high five. Here we go, Rick. Rick, your baits, mates. Arrow coming through. Well, no, I mean, the bounty is fine. They still secure it. Red Panda gets one as well. 50 50. Wait. No, three for Elephant, early GPM lead there, as they scoop three bounty runes. We Aeon Discs and we're gucci I mean, Aeon Discs gets dispelled by uh, Sven, right? I want to say. I think that's a thing. No chance of winning. I mean, they can win. I ain't heard no fat lady. I ain't heard no fat lady. Yo, FY. Um, the spin to win on Yang Gang. He's uh, he's taking a furious beating here. Looking very red headed and stepchild like. A courier snipes for the win. Yo, are you okay, Chen? Why? He's giving him the old diggeroo. 54 right click damage versus 49. Well, not that much difference in it, but trading super well in the end. Okay, versus Yang. Yang with one CS so far. Nothing to worry about too much right there. The arrow comes through. Lan M, most of his regen. And all that time getting up there. 4.5 HP regen, and he's not even underneath the tower. 11.5 with a tango. He'll be fine. Feels like Mission Impossible for Mirana with those items right now. He's like a null tally. He's going, uh, not a null tally. Okay. Wraith band. Going first. Going first. So the blood blast for Uros. A little space for Red Panda for the pool across. Pretty cool. Or is he waiting to stack? He's going to stack first. And uh, a decent pull through for Rubik though. That nicely done. It's got some frosty ghosties as well. Very good if it happens to hit the ranged creep. <laughs> FY gang. He's on the patrol, mate. He's on the patrol. Well, he knows this pool. Oh, no, the courier. Oh, the courier. On oh, them, though. He's going to show back in here. The jig is up. Monet. They know as well, though. Yang gang. He's going to come over here. Side pool for the next creep wave. Or he's gonna fight. I was trying to get the creep wave, it's not gonna happen in time though. Downstairs, fighting. Action. Cameras. FY rotating. It's three minutes though, so this rotation a little bit surprising. What's the play here? Oh, he's stacking the ancients. Okay. Oh, double stack. Very nice. Very nice indeed. We caught it in action. See it so often where they farm it up, but not necessarily where they actually when they actually get the job done. This mid lane going very well indeed for Mr. Dazzle here. I would say that he gets vortexed, pull back under the tower, but it's still going very well for him. He is just dandy. 
screen. Half minutes, Red Panda. Now pulling across here. XXS wants to fight this. Of course he does. Look at this. The empower damage. Ooh, ooh, ooh. CS, XXS. Four minutes is coming up though, so. Instant replay. We've got it. I was going to say the rotation should be happening, but Marana apparently is back here already. He's in. He's not up here to fill the bottle. He's here to get the kill. A leap forward and boom, there it is. That kill miss saved him. FY needed to take the kill, but it's like four minutes. You're like free rune. Boca actually ends up getting the rune. What's that about? I don't know. I don't know. That was. I mean, he goes ahead, right? He goes ahead. Four and a half minutes, next fight. Point the five minute bounties. The skewer across. Paparazzi and Deep Doo Doo here. The left back. He's dead. A little tickle from Baboka and the Fade Bolts. Make sure it happens. 13 seconds on the sideline. A little bit unfortunate for the bounty rune timings, right? Red Panda wants to be here to soak any XP that he can. He can't contest two versus one. The bounty rune is going to end up dying as well. That would be super bad. I don't think they kill him though. Yang Gang though. Gonna make one bounty rune sorted out here. Oh, Chen. Deny. Oh, very sick. Very sick play. Luke Storm. Oh, nothing for poor Grishnak. Nothing for poor Somnus. Does he have to just go Fountain? Or does he get some mangoes here? Oh, oh, the TP though. The TP from Marana. Here you go, sir. I mean, you could have... Didn't work. Oh, I had no space for the bottle. Yeah, it was a good skewer. It was a good skewer. Talking about good skewers. They're looking for another one here right now. No, it's very sedate right now, guys. Two kills, six minutes, no problem. Baboka, talking of two kills, are you about to be three kills? Here comes Storm Spirit to make sure it is. Okay, nice fire blast to hold XXS back. He's got Vortex on top of it. Nice skewer, sort of. Uh, Storm Hammer in one sec, he's dead anyway. Sort of a great skewer. Great skewer there. I mean, um, yeah. I mean, maybe if his juggernaut TP did. Where's Sonic, guys? I'm a little bit worried. It's been more than two hours. Feeling okay? Oh, your bets are lose. Why would you bet on the losing team? Been pretty, uh, we've been pretty good today, I think, at the Jeev channel. A lot of winners. Mostly 90% of the crowd have been betting the winner, so... Doing something right? Mostly been about drafts today though, I have to say. Uh, and Sven's winning games, mostly. <laughs> So, Mask of Madness is done with the Power Treads and the Bracer. It's not actually done, Chief. Oh. He goes for the Power Treads first. He needs to be a little bit sturdier in the lane. What was that lane versus? It was Magnus and Rubik. Yeah, I guess with the Skewer and the left, they've got options. Look at this deforestation right now. Green Protector's weeping right now. It's poor tree, friends. On A with the Crimson Blade. Oh man, badass. All of their items are worth like hundreds of pounds, man. Pretty freaky. It's pretty freaky. Oh, Red Panda. Nice fire blast. Keep a Boca in under the tower. The tower's not paying him much attention, though. A little bit of telekinesis action. Some Cinder Brew. Get him on fire. Now, though, here comes Mon A. RP. This threat is. Will actually be deployed this time around to stun for a few seconds. He's looking for the split. He splits. 
And now can he actually make anything happen here? Juggernaut taken out of the fracas for a few seconds or more. Any backup coming for Yang Gang? I don't think so, right? Yang Gang, the Earth Panda being chased here. All right, another, another tornado. Okay, he should get out alive then. Nice. The versatility of the Brewmaster in action there. You see Mone just disabled for the entirety of the fight, more or less. XXS is doing all right for farm, by the way. Pink Dagger on the way, top tower. Up, up. Up top here, Sven Daddy, you could call him. I guess you could, right? Because it's paparazzi. Pinky. Uh, Dyer's top tower is under attack. Not my problem, but Dyer's top tower just fell. TPing, you got not money in the jungle here. He's going straight Manta. He's got the empowerment. This is what we talked about, right? That's what you wanted to see, Jeeves, when you said off lane Magnus. Run over and power him up. Farm. Oh my god. I mean let's him farm, but if you've got if you've got FY on your team and he's stacking you ancients, then uh, good luck keeping up. Oh he's got stack he's got stacked normal camp as well. Oh my god. And the bounty runes, 10 minutes, by the way. 10 minutes, 6k net worth. Feels good, man. Feels good. Juggernaut, he's feeling pretty goddamn good as well. He's got 4.3k net worth. Alright, Somnus. He's doing alright for himself, by the way. 4.7k. Oh, the bloodlust, the right click, the deadly right click of the storm spirit. You ain't seen nothing yet, boys. Wait till you see this shit in action. Look at this right click. Oh, baby. Practically demolishes the tower with those two hits. No, what did he steal? Oh, no. Got the static remnant. And it's not bad. Oh, he finds his comps. The comps, no. Feasting, ping, bring the Sven, bring everyone. Oh yes, oh yes, the golden shower, tastes so good, let's go, wait, 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 back in the mid lane, there's a little bit of fire blast action going on, the skewer, XXS didn't catch anyone, by the way, Yang Gang goes for the little brew split, gets the spin off, gets some holds in place, Baboka, the chase down, by the way, Papa's here, and he is ready with some storm hammer, double edge, blade, silver edging, it's Echo Saber, Jeeves, Echo Sabering action, he doesn't even have it, oh my god. He was bloodlusted. He hit him hard with the sword. Mask of Madness, though. Mask of Madness. I almost feel bad. Seven to one right now. Four K net worth to Elephant. Aster and their mid dazzle. And he's got a Necro Book. It's online. Necro Book two, one. Them energy, right, is the uh, the lichen he played. Oh, I mean, this, these ancients still haven't been taken, by the way. Who actually blocked this next stack of them? I guess that was intentional. I thought Sven was going to come and fight here. Uh, they ignite to start things off. They've got the Moonlight Shadow, but there's a... I mean, Monet. They have a Sentry Ward. Monet wants to farm this... What did he steal? What did he steal at night? No, he's a solo cinder breed. Red Panda. I mean, this is super dangerous. Somehow he's getting away with it, though. He will pop out. Yang Gang in amongst all of them. Lan N. This is so Kleiny. This is a Clyde Fiesta right here. A little save. Okay. Push the storm down to low ground into the telekinesis, but he'll just zip back the other way. On the way out, this Mr. Dazzle's gonna die. What was that, man? XXS is burning, dodge the arrow, a little cinder brew, he's dead! <laughs> he's dead from cinder brew. And Sven, Sven who? He's over here just doing his own thing. Well, elephant four man stomp all over Aster's face, first 10 kills delivered. Signed and sealed. I love this energy from uh, from Elephant right now. Alright, alright, 
alright, alright, alright. He tried to pull he tried to pull the old Dazzle mid. Not online yet though, it's not online yet. Level 18, that's when the dream the dream dazzle mid situation really unfolds. Red Panda, no fear, look at this. He's right up in their face behind the tier 2 tower, igniting fools. Yang Gang, he's gonna give him the little look now as well. FY, he's like, come at me with your army, Lan M. I will feast Baboka. High ground though, the lift up. This could be something. Nice fade bolt. Nice. The arrow does go out. He steals up a little bit of ignite action. Pulling him back in. Yang Gang ready with the bruise split. Goes on to Dazzle on that back line. Punching him up. Bringing him down. He's all earned up. He's trying to get out. He's all bang up. Yang Gang still chasing. Hand of God coming through now. Somehow still alive on the Dazzle. Running away. Mirana very, very low indeed. You'll be fine, don't worry about that. We catch that dazzle kill. It's all Gucci and the Hoochie. Oh no. Oh no, Monet. Was that a swift strike? No, that was full on Omni Slash. Yeah, they, uh, they get a kill back. They get a kill back. Ben ready. Click Shadow, the Echo Saber. But Monet steps forward a little bit too far. Yang Gang. How long in this Moonlight Shadow? Like 15 seconds. They've got a sentry here. They know there's no vision. Bonnie's spooked though. He's like, where did he go? Alright, he's looking for his Zag Scepter. Now it's Bounty Rune time. Red Panda TPing for the two top. Lan M. Is he going to get there in time to check him here? No, I don't think so. No power rune for one minute. Uh, Sven, he used the God Strength to uh, to farm up the Ancients on the way through there, right? Yeah, he kills off a little bit of Dazzle's creep pack. Costs him somewhat. He's going to rotate top. It's a pretty obvious rotation, though. They know he's going to TP there. So, they see him on the creep lane. So, it makes this fight a little bit easier for Dyer to take, right? So, this is looking for Rubik. That's actually a pretty big pickup. Nice and tasty. I mean, it's not a big pickup, but... 50 seconds on the sideline for the Rubik is, is not too shabby. Buyback situation. Alright, he just needs 150. Well, 135. Double damage on the river. I mean, this is straight into a Roche, right? How much longer for Rubik? 27 seconds. Papa, he doesn't want to come, Luke. He's like, no! No, I killed Tower! So Somnus will take the double damage. Uh, oh, he didn't even get the last hit. He didn't even get the CS. Alright, 789. Have a good time, my dude. Have a good time. Into the Roche Pit. Aro coming in from downtown. Thank you very much, Marana. Bloodlust for everyone, plus double damage for Somnus. His right click is actually appreciable here. 160 damage. He still has the double damage. He's not used to G. Oh. And they can test this. They got... Um, what do they have? Firestorm? No, nah, not really, though. He uh, pray for Washington. I pray for Washington every day. Right, 12k net worth. What does the robot say? Robot is feeling it. Robot is feeling it. 97 to 3% right now. Monet, how's your farm, sir? Well, got the Manta style. Building Axe. This could be good. This could be good. Definitely plays to be made. Thomas rocking with full mana and a double damage. Bloodstone. What about the Dazzle pick potential here? Worthwhile. Oh no, he's coming to fight anyway. They are fighting. They are coming to fight Red Panda. They, they, I mean, they go for it on Sven. He's the first target, I have to say. He's got his Axe Scepter ready to roll. Turn it around with the God Strength. Now in on top of Magnus. Magnus taking a hell of a lot of damage. Will be saved by the Grave. He's already dead now. Magnus, he'll follow him into the Grave. Lan M plus uh, Dazzle getting caught up. Okay, Hand of God. Somnus getting low, but remember, he has the Aegis. He'll be back. He'll be back to drop some action and uh, Lan M trying to escape out to the fountain to chase down. Where did the Dazzle go? He's here, he's dead. The GG is called 2 0. 2 0 for Elephant. Bam. Bam! Ooh, 
There is a victory for the elephants. The big elephant have struck again. Big elephant have struck. 18 to 3 right now. Hmm. I've got to give it to FY again, man. This guy's god tier, actually. Tier 4. Genius. Uh, tier four, four. Very nice, very nice. All right, tomorrow CDA FTC boys. Probably the same time. Might be slightly earlier. We'll see. Um, but good times, good times. Oh, is that three two O's today? Oops. No delay tomorrow. Everywhere's real bad. Yeah, super easy bet today. Super easy bet today. I will run the odds and oh, adios. Ending. Madness. Tip now, if you want to be famous, run to suburbs. the winners minus ev with 3k moji ains with 4k jandy with 2k the shadow one with 10k tinky cat with 10k line us lgs with 1k sean sado with 2.4k and young slipper with 20k i'm general jeevis and i will be back tomorrow back tomorrow